I'm Grump. I'm not so Grump. And we're the Game Grumps. Yeah, this is so fucking embarrassing, man. So like, right before the episode starts, I look at the map, and I'm like, so I'm I'm going to the one, right, with the crystal. Aaron's like, yeah. As a matter of fact. Captain fucking genius man. <laughs> Alright, let's, let's do this. No, I think it was a little more like... Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Whoops, there's the heart piece. Oh, nice. Did you know about that little secret? Yeah, of course. Dude. God damn it. Did you see my fucking fart play the farts play through? <laughs> I had nearly every heart. It's pretty sweet. There's a couple I was missing. Every, every heart for fart? Yes. Wait, there's another one around here, isn't there? Like, uh, right off the bat? Dude, I don't fucking... God, uh, Aaron! <laughs> <laughs> Did you know about this one? Fuck yeah, I knew about it! I know about everything! Have, is there another one nearby? I don't fucking know! <laughs> Why are you badgering me? Some kind of fucking badgery, Barney. Go, uh, go down. down. Oh, yeah. Left. Nope. Uh, Left. Yeah. Down. Okay. Right. Uh-huh. Oh! Damn it! It's Kiki! <laughs> oh, God. I'm Kiki the Monkey Kiki! <laughs> I love rupees more than anything! Do you know why they call me Kiki Kiki? <laughs> uh, can you spare me? No! <laughs> like, just swing your sword and kill him. Can you spare me ten rupees, Kiki? What will you do? Give him ten rupees. Give him ten rupees? Never or... give him <laughs> anything! <laughs> Ever! <laughs> give, yeah. You see, you see him like dying on the side of the road, and he's just like, "Please, sir!" And you're like, "I swore a vow." Yeah. What will you do? Not complete the game, or give him ten dollars? All right. Kiki, Kiki. Good choice. I will accompany you for a while. Kiki, Kiki. All right. Sweet. What if they re-release this game and giving him ten rupees was actually DLC and like? Damn it, Kiki. Yeah, you you got to get him back, and you actually had to pay ten dollars. It, that'd be some serious bullshit. It's like putting your credit card number 995 to get Kiki. It's just 995 to get Kiki. Sup, I'm the move monkey Kiki. Yeah, I'll give you another 10 rupees. Jesus, you get hit with one fucking explosive and you get all fucking touchy. What the fuck is he gonna do with 10 rupees? I don't know. It's a fucking monkey. Maybe it could stop the ringing in my ears. <laughs> God, <laughs> just give me a heart, please. <laughs> that's like the fucking. It's the worst. No, don't dog, oh, come on. Fairy, no? Whoa, that's a strange way to spell fairy. It's fairy. Fairy. That's the. I'm doing it. I can't listen to that. What? Yeah. Oh. I can't listen. Oh damn it! <laughs> <laughs> Come on! <laughs> it's me. Jeez. All right. If you give me a hundred rupees, I'll open the entrance for you. Well. What? Was it? Oh, was it an amazing <laughs> monkey inflation? <laughs> try to open it yourself. Yeah. Try to open it yourself using the sacred monkey rituals that you learned as a child. Get up there, Kiki. Dude, they're- they're running like a fucking monkey fucking scam here. Yeah, you a, see- there's a monkey a, temple. That's a primate racket right you there. See, you can see the fucking gorilla statues, man. Yeah. You monkey get inside, mafia. and it's like... Kiki, Kiki, uh... Do you know where the big key is? I do. Give me your bank numbers. <laughs> I'm a Nigerian give, prince. Give me your routing number. Electronic, not- not yeah. paper. Not to say that people from Nigeria are like monkeys. <laughs> Jesus Christ, I can see the fucking, like... <laughs> Racism patrol, <laughs> like, oh, <laughs> God, just looking to start shit. <laughs> the racism patrol. They are so ready. They're so ready to like make any connection. <laughs> when you said that thing was black, <laughs> did you mean that it was bad? Because no. like, no, I just meant that it was the color black. Yeah, clearly it is. It's the sky at night. <laughs> That's how it is. <laughs> Oh, jeez. Okay. Woo, woo, woo. <laughs> when you said you had red skin and you were diseased, are you saying that Indian people have diseases? No, I was saying that I had a disease and also my skin was red because of it. Yeah. Woo, woo. <laughs> yeah. Are you making fun of Asians because you say the skin is yellow and it's like, no, I have a crippling <laughs> bout of jaundice. <laughs> Thank you for bringing that up. <laughs> oh, Hold that's on. Let me, let that's me go good here stuff. first. Oh, it's the best. If you blow up that ground, you fall into a secret area. A good secret area? Yeah, it's a good one. Really? Yeah. Should I go through the wall first? Uh, sure. Are you sure that's a secret area? <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's an awful lot like a hole. No, you can do it. Alright. Oh, God. oh, these fucking things. Yeah, it's a secret area. It's a spot for secrets. You can go in there and earn some secret, uh... ...stuff. I swear. Okay. Uh, if I'm wrong, then 
I'm sorry. In advance. <laughs> if I'm wrong, then, you know, fuck you. Huh? Well, it's just, it's, it's, you know, it's been a while. <laughs> I'm a child. It's I mean, been a while. Wasn't. Since I said I'm sorry. <laughs> About blowing a hole in the ground. I we must have talked about this before, what? but like one of my favorite like tweets of all time was the fucking guy who has he's like really think I nailed it with the company party DJ playlist and it's, <laughs> it shows it, <laughs> oh, and yeah. it yeah it's like twelve of of it's been a while by stained and then the thirteenth song is the live version of it's been a while. <laughs> Oh. Can you now remember? Oh my god, it's so funny. <laughs> I fucking adore stupid humor like that. Oh man, I adore stained. Yeah, well, join the freaking club. <laughs> Ooh, not a huge fan of this situation. They just fl fly away after a while. Oh, she's a little barfy for a second. It's okay. Um, I think I had bad eggs this morning. Yuck. Yeah, I've had eggs in the fr- well, what I like to do is, like, I have a little custom egg canister in my fridge. Mm -hmm. So I take the eggs out of the carton, and I put them in my little egg canister so they look pretty. But then I don't know when they expire. So, sometimes I go without eating eggs for a while, and then, uh... Well, you can imagine... You can imagine what happens next. Dude, thank God I was sitting down, because that story was too <laughs> interesting. <laughs> I mean, jeez. <laughs> Did you buy it? Could you imagine if my, like, like that story? You told me that story and I was standing and, like, oh, and my knees gave out. You need a dash run now. Go. Dash run. Do it. All right. Now you're fucked. No. It's just maybe back here for a hot second. Yeah, you should dash run right now. Okay. You should go. Doesn't matter if that little guy's in your way. Excuse me, sir. <laughs> a little oh. dingle bat. Well, he is. He, he is just, dingly, isn't it? It just looks like a little child in a suit. And he's just kind of like... <laughs> <laughs> What's going on, Dad? <laughs> <laughs> I got my remote control car with a camera on it. <laughs> <laughs> and Dad's like, stop it. I'm, I'm Stop it. I don't want your mother to see this. <laughs> and he's like, well, I'm going to show mom just to make you mad. And he's like, shut up. And then, so then they don't talk to each other for three days. And then... The, the wife is like, why don't you talk to your son anymore? And he's like, because shut up. And like his kid blackmails him into doing shit that he wants. He needs like lunch money. And he's like, well, give me $10 instead of $5. And he's like, fine. And buys an ice cream cone. And then he learns the value of a dollar. What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> I'm talking about... <laughs> talking about the little helmet guy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, obviously. Dude, dude. <laughs> Sorry. Whoops. Oh, man, I want to fart. I mean, truly nothing's stopping you. Especially me, because God knows I've tried to stop you, and you've let it rip anyway, No, so. but I want to be courteous. That is incredibly nice of you. Chances, however, are slim. <laughs> well, sometimes if I don't want to fart, I just hold it in, you know? You can do that. You have the power. I can do that, and yeah. it burns. Like the fucking fires <laughs> of Allah. Alright. <laughs> oh, oh, boy. Oh, 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 that was possibly overkill. Okay. Okay. This temple is where it starts to get a little hard. Right. But it's not like super hard. Alright. I'm just gonna Whoa. I'm just gonna give you that. It's it's like a it's like when you open up a porno mag you're not really into. <laughs> like you know, like one that's like a little too raunchy and you're like, ew. Yeah. But like it's still sexual, so you're like, huh. I guess. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, really? Who am I to judge? Okay, good. This is what I wanted. Problem child. It is too. not what I wanted. That is not what I wanted. Yeah, you wanted to go on the other side, I think. Maybe. I see that now. I don't know. I don't know if you wanted to do that. That's up to you. Did you want to do that? Yeah, sure. Why not? Okay. Then that's what we would. Do. Yeah, I do. Duh. <laughs> yeah, hot dogs. Duh. <laughs> hot dogs. Duh. Mm. Uh. Did we tell that story on the end? The... I don't know if we did. I think we've made reference to it, but we never actually told the story. No. Go right ahead. A, we just did a thing at improv. God oh, damn it! Yeah, you got screwed. We did a thing at improv <sighs> class that was a. Uh, we just had to tell a monologue in in like in a character. Uh, it was a poem in a character, and uh, where is this thing? Susie chose. You just got to find one, dude. Okay. So it's not over here. Okay. <laughs> Susie chose her character Steve, her beloved Steve, uh, who is, um, her brother, 
quote unquote. Right. <laughs> Got it. And uh, <laughs> I don't know. She just said, "I go to the, go to the bowling alley, and I go to the, I get the I get the food at the concession stand." And what do you get from a concession stand at a bowling alley? Hot dogs, duh. <laughs> <laughs> it's the way she said it. Yeah. And also, like, because because you love her so much, mm -hmm. and you love, like, her mannerisms and stuff, like, everyone in the class laughed, but you laughed, like, super extra hard for yeah. extra long. Which is very sweet, actually. It's like, when, you know, like, the, the kid in class has a crush on a girl, and she <laughs> says something funny, and everyone was like, ha ha, and he's like, ah ha ha! <laughs> oh, you're a delight in every way. I mean, it had nothing to do with the fact that I think she's swell. Yeah. She. It was just funny. <laughs> yeah. Hot dogs, duh. Hot dogs, duh. I don't know. It was, it was hilarious. It's just a special moment. Susie's a funny girl. She is. Okay, so now we got this. We got this. I think I have a crush on Susie. Do you really? Yeah. Oh my god, you should totally tell her. I don't know, man. I'm nervous. <laughs> I'm nervous. <laughs> what if she, what says, if she says no? No, duh. <laughs> uh, what if she yeah. makes fun of my small penis? Well, <laughs> then. What if I say, like, hey, I think you're cute, and then she just bashes my tiny penis? Yeah. She's like, well, about that time I saw your dick. <laughs> She's like, she's like, ew, gross, your tiny penis. And I'm like, no. Uh, first of all, the correct term is micro penis. <laughs> and I'll thank you to refer to it as such. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I knew a guy who had micro penis. Do you really? Yeah, sure. <laughs> God damn it, don't sell out your own story. This is my favorite thing in this game. <laughs> Boing! This, this is the hook shot. shot. <laughs> the game knows it. Yeah, it extends and contracts and, and boing! <laughs> it can grapple many things. Oh, cool. Oh, it's a good feeling. I wasn't selling out my own story. Woo! I was saying that I know a guy who has a tiny penis and I see him every day in the morning in the mirror. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> There's nothing to sell out. Oh, Aaronin. <laughs> Aaronin. Aaronin. Would, would that be my, like, Arabic name? You're so crazy, Aaronin. Aaronin. Thanks, man. I do what I can. God damn it. And I can what I do. Mm. And I sell it at a discount price. <laughs> you gotta go up. Yeah. See that now? You gotta go that only way you haven't gone. <laughs> do I? Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> go left! Go left! There's like literally like an arrow on the screen that says yeah. like left. <laughs> yeah, like, I do walkthroughs and like, it's just a video of you like pointing and being like, uh, uh, uh. <laughs> 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 oh my god, can we do that? Yeah, absolutely. Oh my god, that's such a good idea. <laughs> World's most unhelpful walkthrough. It's like... It's like a fucking... <laughs> it's like a recording of the game. <laughs> and then you green screen yourself going like... With your finger. <laughs> ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> Uh, wait, 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 no, 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 <laughs> Oh my god! <sighs> Why hasn't that been done? It probably has been. No way. Uh, this one or the- Ah, oh, oh, fuck it. fucking do that. I have to do that. Oh my god. Alright, I'm doing that. These always make it look like you're getting like crazy blowjobs from these things when you're like, oh, hold on, I don't know if you're doing Oh, damn it. Alright. With your giant silver penis. Yeah, what about it? Hey, users, um, users. Uh, viewers, lovelies, as we call them, mm -hmm. as you call yourselves. Mm -hmm. What do you think? The first game you play, the first time you played this, was it fun? And then the second time, were you like, oh man, this level? Even though. Yeah, let me just get to the good stuff. Yeah. How do you feel? Like, comment, subscribe. <laughs> all of those, please. All three. Thanks for doing that. If you're subscribed, then unsubscribe so that you can resubscribe. Yes, please. Every time you subscribe, we get five million dollars each, after tax. <laughs> 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 so thank you. <laughs> That's like an obnoxious number. <laughs> <laughs> Any 
Anytime you say after taxes, you immediately become like twice as much of a douche as you were before. Five million dollars after taxes. Yeah. Holy shit, that's probably like eight million dollars then. Oh yeah. My god. Well, why do you think we're always asking him to like, comment, and subscribe? Yeah, because it feeds us. Yeah. Our god damn it. delicious daily caviar. <laughs> Caviar is disgusting it is and gross. expensive. I do not understand why it is like rich people food. It's like eating pure salt. Yeah, but in like gross embryonic form. <laughs> god, you're fucking just blowing your money, dude. I'm not blowing it. There, <gasps> see? Oh my god, she's beautiful. I know. Oh, that's what it'll let me do. Now I can carry more stuff. I can carry, carry more, more bombs. bombs. Yeah, that's yeah. way better. Okay. This is a small happiness that I can give you. Thank you. You can carry more. Life destroying, <laughs> destructive instruments of death and despair. Just think of all the the fucking evil that you can do <laughs> with these bombs. Your happiness increased by one step. <laughs> all I want to do is bestow upon you this little piece of uh, happiness. Didn't get far enough. <laughs> Blow up that fucking wall. <laughs> Blow the shit out of that wall. Okay, here we go. Throw in a few. Those Boom. are great against Dodongos. Hello again. Thanks for a hundred dollars. <laughs> Here's more bombs for you. Wow, that's a lot. Dumbass. Yeah. Just a small happiness. Twenty. All right, twenty should be good enough. Do you want this buckshot rifle? <laughs> Just a little happiness that I can bestow upon you. It's used you. generally for killing children. <laughs> all right, so but next you time can also <laughs> kill boar and deer. <laughs> next time on Gangrabs, we're going into this portal and going into the ice cave. Woohoo! Yeah, that's goddamn right. Oh man. See you then, baby. Goodbye. God, I had a- oh man, I really need to- you know what, I'm gonna write okay. that down. I had an idea for a video series, and I sort of don't want to say it on the show, because I don't want my idea to get stolen. Okay. But it's gonna be a grump out video. No one would steal your idea. I promise you it's gonna be way too dumb. Well, I'm gonna do it anyway. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna do, uh, I guess I'll say it. No, no, no. No? Yeah, yeah, save okay. it. Let it be an exciting surprise for everyone. Okay. Just whisper it into my ear. Mouth the words. Okay. And you're like, Kill Barry. <laughs> <laughs> it's like really stupid though, and I came up with it like six years ago, mm -hmm. and then I still think about it and it makes me laugh, and I'm like, okay, that's a good sign. Yeah, actually. Because anything I did six years ago does not make me laugh, except for this photograph. <laughs> 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 Look at this graph! <laughs> <laughs> oh god. We had one night recently. We we went to round oh, one. Oh my god. And on the drive home we fucking lost our minds with laughter. <laughs> uh just watching these crazy fucking videos and one of them was the the look at this graph version of look at this photograph by Nickelback. I don't know if everyone's seen oh that. God. I'm hoping they have. You know, look at this photograph. Yeah. But like <laughs> they just cut it so it's look at this graph. But the graph of course does not go uh Tonally with the rest of the thing, so it's like, look at this graph. <laughs> that was like way too on key. To, it was like, it's like, look at this graph. <laughs> yeah, it's hard to sing off key on purpose. <laughs> also, one of my favorite videos is, oh, what the fuck was it? Oh, it's this video from like Pawn Stars or whatever, or like you know, or you know the video, the the show where they like. Ow. The storage units, they go and they buy them. Oh, yeah, sure. Storage Wars. That's the one. Uh... And <laughs> there's, like, a guy and he's like... He's like, what the fuck is this, or some shit. And then yeah. there's, like, this, this, like, this big, huge black dude, but he has, like, the tiniest voice yeah, ever. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he's just like, what's your profanity? <laughs> <laughs> and the guy's like, I'm sorry, you're right. <laughs> oh, my God. That's my fucking favorite. Just look up, watch your profanity. <laughs> watch my your profanity. Watch your profanity. <laughs> <laughs> but you should get the stuff on the right, too. Okay. Before you do anything. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Didn't like that. Tricked you. God, that's like when you lift a big rock and there's just like a fucking wonderland <laughs> of like gross yeah. bugs underneath and you're like, whoa! Like all different species and <laughs> sizes you're and like, shapes. I have ruined an ecosystem. <laughs> Sorry, fellas. <laughs> and none of them just like stick around. They're like, shit! <laughs> yeah. Jesus, it's the fuzz! There's a. <laughs> There's always one like slow pill bug who's like, oh, <laughs> darn it. Man, I, <laughs> I had like a mortgage and a 401k. Yeah. Now I gotta fucking move shop.
Hey. It's a secret to everyone. <laughs> hey. It's a secret to everyone. Ow. It's a se Ow. <laughs> Man, I love pot. Da -da 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 -da. You, you can earn a lot of rupees by defeating enemies. It's the secret of my success. Wow. <laughs> And what a success you've <laughs> achieved, my friend. Look at all this. <laughs> and you, here you are. You literally live under a under rock. Under a rock. <laughs> by yourself. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, ho. Hey, 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 hey. Hi hey, hey. hey, there. Hey, 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 hey. Aaron, you just looked up what we should do, so why don't you tell that to me? All right. Uh, go use your bird. All right. Call your bird. I'm going to get you all three medallions in this episode. Oh, my God. Really? Yeah, all three of them. Here we go. Ha-ha! <laughs> <laughs> the bird's like, fuck you! Woo! <laughs> <laughs> Gotta be quicker than that, bitch! <laughs> <laughs> Does he just not come after three? Alright. <laughs> He's just like, you know what? <laughs> fuck you! <laughs> <laughs> he like keeps like going up into the sky and circling around like, oh! <laughs> Go to five! Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I am so fucking done. Okay. Alright. Alright, alright. So done! Here we go. Uh, go into your portal. Okay. <laughs> Oh man, that's really funny. <laughs> that was a winner. All right, uh, just go back up. All right, we're good. Yeah, you good? Yeah, we're good. Um, uh, and then just keep going up. Up here? Yeah, brother. Fantastic. Brother from the same mother. If we were brothers from the same mother, we would just be brothers. Yeah, but I mean, you could. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Whatever. Yeah. About that. Yeah. Oh, I just remembered something. What? Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> You totally caught me off guard with that. <laughs> I was like, what did, what did you remember, Dan? Yeah. Please, share! Tell, tell me the thing. Um, yeah, and then should left. You wanna go left, 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 left. Wait, 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 wait. You did it last time, you did it in the last episode, you should remember. Oh, you I do remember this, okay. Big poop. Okay. You big warp guy. Okay, you bash people with my hammer? Yeah, that's, that's, that's a very effective weapon. Feels good. You it's, should be able to bash the rocks. It's the Mario Donkey Kong. What? Uh, it's the Mario Donkey Kong hammer. That he has like the poop 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 when the oh, yeah. are coming. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's it. Um Danky Bong <laughs> Bluntry. <laughs> Wait, uh you're gonna need to I'm gonna go, pause go the episode down. and then you can explain to me what the fuck you just said. <laughs> <laughs> what? what did you say? Danky bong bluntry. <laughs> Danky <laughs> Was that an attempt to do make three pot references in a row? I didn't come up with that. That's, that's I saw that somewhere. Danky bong blunt tree. I'm pretty sure you didn't see that somewhere. I did. Oh my god. Uh, go left. Okay. <laughs> Danky. <laughs> I've only recently heard the term dank, and it oh, fucking yeah. oh man, it really just I love it. Well, my friend used to do that. Like he he used to he was a stoner named Dave, and, like, he used to, like, High Times Magazine would have, like, th this website, um, where, you know, it would be, like, half-naked girls covered in weed, and, like, they'd, like, ask you to comment, and all the comments were like, oh my god, she's so hot, and, like, look at those boobs, and, like, all that kind of stuff, and then he was like, oh man, that looks like some dank buds. <laughs> So stupid. All right, so here we are. I'm, it, I'm gonna go into these things, huh? Yeah. Okay. Did I ever tell you about that one yoga class I took? Yes. Well, we were talking about. I started taking yoga uh, this past week, um, and we were discussing that off camera. And uh, yeah, why don't you tell me about it? Well, because I've never heard this story. I went there with a friend a long time ago, mm -hmm. um, just to try it out, because he was interested, and I was like, whatever, I'll go. Right. It'll be a good story. Turns out it was. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> The yoga teacher who, I don't know, like, she was, like, low 40s, mm -hmm. early 40s, I guess is how you call bucks. it. Um, and, uh, you know, she was, like, she was a little spacey. Right. But, like, I was doing everything right. Not that I have, like, an ego about fucking yoga poses. Sure, sure. But, like, I wasn't having trouble or anything. Right. But she, like, volunteered coming over and being, like, no, it's more like this. And then just fucking ass in the face. Like... What? Like, yeah, like, she was... 
She just put her ass in your face? Yeah, she was like, <laughs> clearly like... I'm- I'm the only, like, young dude in the class, and, Oh, yeah. oh, gotcha. And, uh, and she was like, I like this, and like, just f it was right there. <laughs> and I'm, I'm just like, there's no way that you're not, like- Like, there's not- yeah, Aware you're of your surroundings <laughs> and realizing that you're shoving your ass in my face. When- yeah, when you put your ass in someone's face, you're generally the first or second to know about it. <laughs> where am I going? Which- which hole? You gotta choose which hole to fall in. It's probably the one on the far right. You know when you, like, you make the sentence. <laughs> you make somebody laugh. Yeah. And then they're like, you're so funny, but it doesn't mean anything because you don't think they have a good sense of humor. <laughs> oh, sure. <laughs> sure. Oh, there I, was, I hate that feeling. Because then it makes me feel like an asshole, too. There was a girl in my high school, um, who, like, for whatever reason, the only responses she would have to anything are, you're so funny, and I'm so sorry. And like, just she would just go back and forth between all of them. <laughs> and she was just like, you're so funny, I'm so sorry. And my friend had this like comic that he drew of her where like, he thought she was actually like just a human Pez dispenser. And like one day she was gonna overload and Pez was just gonna come out of her neck. Like she was just gonna be like, you're so funny, I'm so sorry, you're so funny, I'm so sorry. <laughs> and then just like, oh sweet, Pez. <laughs> I'm glad you found that funny, because before I told that story, I was like, is this funny at all? <laughs> so, like, each you're so funny, I'm so sorry is, like, a piece of Pez. No, she just, like, says it back and forth, and her head's, like, lolling from side to side, and then it overloads, and then her neck opens up, and Pez comes out. <laughs> it's so funny to think about that now. God, that was a long time ago. What is a Pez dispenser? Like I know a, it's a weird idea, it's, isn't it? It's so bizarre. I know. I've I've thought that myself. Like there's no other candy that's like it. No, there's no other candy that you have to retrieve from the throat of another creature. <laughs> and it's so like collectible. It's oh god, it's so weird. Yeah. Like I would never. That's yeah. that's a complete. Do you like lie. Mickey I would Mouse? Love a grump head it, Pez dispenser. Yeah, oh, that'd be awesome. Do you like Mickey Mouse? Do you like Donald Duck? Would you like to retrieve candy from their tracheas? <laughs> Not even- it's like barely candy. I- I know. It's- it's, it's probably like 90% xanthan gum and like 2% <laughs> sugar and then 8% question mark. <laughs> yeah, that's actually a very good way of putting it. Oh Wow, man. you can really taste the question mark. <laughs> what even is that shit? Test. Damn it, never mind. <laughs> a little test of what? I was gonna test it and see if I turn it into a fairy, if it just stays a fairy forever. And I can just go get it whenever I want. But, decided. I see. Caught a big old case of the fuck yous. <laughs> a big old case of the fuck yous? That's what I'm talking about. I get that every time I order a sandwich at Subway. <laughs> what do you mean? Just like... If, if there's somebody but Like, everything about Subway is, is like, infuriating. Really? Yeah, it's like... The people in front of you take too long, and like there's no drive-through, and like it's it's just all. I don't know. I'm over exaggerating, obviously, but Subway's like the land of inconveniences. Yeah, it's. I mean, because it's like it, ugh, I have to be okay, and they're like, "What do you want?" And I'm like, "Uh, a sweet onion chicken teriyaki foot long on flatbread," and then they're like, "What bread?" And it's like, ugh. <laughs> Flatbread, and they're like, oh, okay, and then they, they fucking take, and they're like, did you say foot long? Yes, I said foot long. Yeah, and oh, like, you, you want cheese? You already have so many, like, bad experiences with the place <laughs> yeah. that, like, it becomes self-fulfilling prophecy. <laughs> yeah. Like, the second you walk in, they're like, hi, how can I help you? And you're like, oh, <laughs> with this shit Not again. This again. <laughs> <laughs> and it's like, you want cheese? It's like, yeah, can I get, um, Swiss cheese? And they're like, what kind? And it's like, fucking... <laughs> yeah, you know. The kind I just said. Ugh. And they're like, toast it? And it's like, of course toast- You can't have the flatbread and not toast it! Yeah. It's- it's like spongy, gross, starchy-ass fucking bread. <laughs> it's made to be toasted. Wow. Of course I want it toasted. And then they fucking toast it, and then they start helping the people behind you, and then it sits <laughs> in the toaster for like 20 <laughs> seconds longer than it's supposed to. Whoa! And you're like, I just want lunch! You are... And you... then they fucking take it out, and it's like another person, and then you have to fucking <laughs> get a read on their personality. 
<laughs> it's like, God damn it! And they're like, what do you want? And it's like, and I'm like, uh, spinach. And then they just fucking destroy it with spinach. Just like an avalanche of spinach. And you're like, I want like five other things! You can't just fill it up with spinach and think that's all it's gonna be. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. And then you fuck it, and then you're like, onion, and they're like, okay, and they put like two onions on it, and it's like, more onion, please! <laughs> <laughs> and then when you like, get some weird combination, like fucking, could I get mayonnaise and also sweet onion sauce? They finally, they like, throw up their eyeball, uh, eyebrows a little bit, like, whoa. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> And you're like, don't fucking judge me, I'll eat what I want, I can make my own sandwich! <laughs> don't fucking judge me! <laughs> wow, next time on Game Run. <laughs> next time on Wow! <laughs> Bro, you just went fucking off on Subway. All you had to say was their food is gross. <laughs> That's what I say. <laughs> I was just gonna say, I got that burning desire. Wait, that's gonna re. <laughs> Put that in, Kevin. And the game grumps! Hey, hey, hey. Oh, hey, 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 hey. Hey, what? What? Hey. I'm Sorry. lost, Aaron. <laughs> <laughs> We can beatbox all we want, but Yo, the it doesn't whole change the fact. Beatbox of just fucking. You don't have the. You were yeah, just here. I was just here. I was just here. Yeah, you're such a. Well, for everyone else, I was here 24 hours ago. Such a confused lad. Okay. These fucking slugs spit out bombs like whoa. Yeah, you best. Be, you best represent the fucking slug bombs. <laughs> slug bombs, bitch. Do you think it's their feces? Uh, I do. I definitely do. What do you think they eat in order to create the bombs as their feces? Probably Subway. <laughs> Subway eats, um, powder keg, uh, pa and yeah, rubbery chicken, <laughs> and, and wicks, rubbery chicken, <laughs> yeah, that's pretty accurate. How about this? You're so smart. You like this that I'm doing? You're so smart. Boom. You're making my penis. Just making Out it. Out of thin air. <laughs> Well, that didn't do anything. Wow. <laughs> nice, nice work. Why would they do that to me? <laughs> no! <laughs> Doo -doo. Something very painful about that sound effect. <laughs> <laughs> You're just like a hooker, like a fucking bass. Woo! Just, <laughs> just fucking stuck her with the end of that spear. That was really funny. Fucking hook shot. She's like, get over here. Munch. Look at the size of that bomb. <laughs> Talk to me, Max Greedo. I just like the fuck that you walk in. What? <laughs> like he's just sitting there behind the counter, like waiting for somebody to come in, and you just walk in and you're like, look at the size of that bomb! And he's like, yeah, I know. Yeah, like, yeah. It's like the moment he's been waiting for. Yeah, like, oh, awesome. <laughs> Sucker's born every minute. <laughs> Thank you very much. Drop this bomb off anywhere. All right. But there is a specific place. There is a space. You may have noticed that there is a, uh, a giant crack, uh, <laughs> in your butt. Um, <laughs> thanks, I will be, uh, I will be here this all This is my weekend. last episode of Game Grumps, uh, <laughs> thank you all for joining me on this yeah, journey. Now that I've reached the pinnacle of humor, <laughs> I think I'll be retiring from comedy. Boom. There's one. That's some blue motherfucking potion. Boom. There's two. He's like, wow, alright. Bam. You want a point card? Two. He's like, well, Christ, I mean, you know you don't get credit towards your next one. Alright. I didn't think, yeah, like... So three blue ones and an emergency fairy. That's, that's what I needed. Could have bought them all at once and given you a 10% discount or something. Alright, jeez, Aaron. <laughs> don't fucking criticize my thrifty shopper saving <laughs> skills. Thrifty shopper saving skills. You're really good Maybe at saving oh, thrifty okay. shoppers. <laughs> <laughs> they're like, they're like, no, I wanted 10% off on this, and you're like, 
Well, sir, you're in luck! <laughs> Again? <laughs> yes! Yeah, what about it? Wait, doesn't this guy heal me if I walk inside his place? I think he said he would. I think the wizard. Blah, blah, blah! Yeah, that's comfort nice. Comfort your weariness. <laughs> yeah, I'll comfort your weariness. I'll also help with your loneliness if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> I'm saying I'm gonna fuck you. <laughs> Just crazy, explicit, out of nowhere. Aggressively. <laughs> mm. Mm -hmm. I love the way your face looks. <laughs> Betwixt my butt cheeks. <laughs> if only I could witness it. <laughs> if only we had a full-sized mirror on the ceiling. Oh, I do! <laughs> Wow, dude, look at that! Oh, what a coincidence. Marvelous. Ugh. Very clever. D dude, fucking... <laughs> did Barry show you? Um, we went to a, uh... We went to a Japanese restaurant in Little Tokyo. Uh -huh. Did he show you what was on the menu? Uh-uh. Hold on. Can you hand me my phone? Uh, yes. I'll send this to Kevin. There you go. So... The audience can see it at the same time. <laughs> It's really important. Really important. This is super important. It's super important. Here we go. And any second now. God, you get a lot of picture tasks. I, sh I sure do. All right. Check out what I'm pointing to. Cherry blossom. <laughs> <laughs> we were dying. <laughs> Did you ask for it? No! God oh knows God. we wanted to, though. Oh, God, I would totally fucking be like, can I get the cherry blossom, yeah. please? Notice also at the bottom there, you can order Johnny Scallops. <laughs> Not Johnny Scarabs. John, <laughs> no. That'd be ridiculous. <laughs> cherry blossom. Cherry blossom. Oh, my God. At least it's not cherry bosom. It's not. Just left it out altogether. <laughs> cherry bosom. <laughs> <laughs> get back! What, get back! What, what, what are you doing? What are you doing? It's Franklin! He got out again! <laughs> Franklin! <laughs> Aaron, if there's one thing... What? If there's one thing we've agreed on like, all these years of doing gaming, uh -huh. is that we never talk about Franklin, our monkey child slave. <laughs> Wait, well, just, I mean, what are we gonna do? Just cut the- cut his part out? He's ruining the show. <laughs> get out, Franklin! Franklin, oh. get back in your cage! I don't want to talk about this. Get back in your mobile cage. <laughs> we don't have, like, a wall unit. We bought a thing at a pet store, and we just keep him in that. <laughs> but we don't move it, so it's not actually mobile. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Dan, take care of him! I need you to be more present right now, for me. We are in the last dungeon. I would be if Franklin wasn't in here, <laughs> messing up all our shit! It's fucking fa- Okay, what- what do I bomb here? Why doesn't he just communicate like a normal human Aaron, being? Aaron, please! <laughs> it's probably because he's a weird monkey child. How do you get down there? Maybe push one of these? I feel like I tried everything as a kid, and I was just like, I don't- and it, you never come back to it. Weird. I want to know now. Seriously. I want to know too. This is gonna fucking- it's yeah, gonna look bother it up. me, because it it's bothered me for the- my entire life. <laughs> so that's how I know. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what, Zelda Dungeon? Yeah, ZeldaDungeon.net. Dungeon.net. I just searched Zelda Dungeon Link to the Past. Cool. Shout out to our boy, Zelda Dungeon. <laughs> 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 Too much. <laughs> this isn't a fucking morning radio show. <laughs> hey, what's up? It's Grease Man here. Blip. It's, da it's Danny the Raptor. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Don't fart on my face, Danny. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Flush. Okay. Oh man, dude, you're so close. I can smell Ganon's pit stench. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, that is the worst. <laughs> Smells like fucking. It was like rotting eggs and bad cologne mixed with whiskey and bourbon. <laughs> what is he, Armenian? <laughs> oh god, I'm, you know what? We should strike that from the record, please. <laughs> we just have an Armenian friend who we joke about like that all the time. With, with his permission. Oh yeah. Oh boy. Shouldn't have let that one slip out. I just really pissed off a very slender <laughs> group of our fan base. Nah, I feel like they'd be like, eh. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> At least what? it was specific. If I saw you on the street, I'd beat the shit out of you, so. But, yeah. I'm never gonna see you. Yeah, here we are. 
Well, oh, fuck. scanning time. Never met. Oh, you do the voice. I never imagined a boy like you could give me so much trouble. It's unbelievable that you <laughs> defeated my alter ego, Aghanim, the Dark Wizard, twice. Two times. But I will never give you the Triforce. I will destroy you and make my wish to conquer. Both light and dark worlds come true without delay. Hey, hey! There's no, like, come at you or... Yeah. Uh, ha Just silver arrows? Engage. Uh, nope. no, it's only in his final form. Oh, okay. You just hit him with your sword. Ow. 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 <laughs> Wish I wasn't just a slow pig. Ow. Ow. Oh. Really? What? Hey. Last guy? <laughs> yeah. Oh, God. I thought I was way stronger than this. Oh. Now, touch it with a wish in your heart. <laughs> oh, you got it, baby. <laughs> <laughs> You're like trying not to mess it up. You're like, world peace, world peace, world peace, world peace. <laughs> Hot girl, damn it! Damn it! Well, it's good for me, but not for world peace. Yeah. Oh, you are hot, though. <laughs> <laughs> Oof. Ooh, the return of the king. Lord of the Rings reference. Hyrule Castle. Wait, there was a king? Yeah. What the fuck? Yeah, remember we were trying to save her dad at the very beginning? That's what the knights look like? Yeah, they're all friendly, but you murdered a ton of them. You like, like, a lot. A loyal sage. <laughs> remember me? I died too! <laughs> yeah. I can't say much through these sunglasses indoors. Oh, the, the fucking kid had recovered. Oh, Did yay, you see him? the bug kid. Yeah, and the brothers have made up. Oh, he didn't turn into a hideous bug monster. And the bird is like, what do I do now? They were just paid to stand there and wait. Vultures rule the shit. desert. Okay, I guess that's I guess that's okay. <laughs> yeah, motherfucker. We oh, there's rule the guy opening now. the chests. It's like, for God's sake, I gotta find something to save me from these vultures. <laughs> the a bully, bully makes, makes it. Oh, this is what they're like when they're not evil. Oh yay! Oh, oh they really don't look very friendly. No. It looks like he's just ready to beat the shit out of him. Your uncle doesn't die? What? Whoa! Oh, man. Purple Hair Magoo! <laughs> he still doesn't have a name. I can't believe you lived. Could have easily put a comma and then a name. Flippers for sale. I mean, that really is neither here nor there. Yeah, I'm still selling shit. What about <laughs> it? Don't worry about me. <laughs> Get that camera out of my fat! <laughs> the witch and the assistant. Dude, I hope the fucking flute guy comes back to life. Uh, I'll feel no. so <laughs> no. It's like an extra scream. Uh. Flute guy's still dead. <laughs> <laughs> the woodsman's hut. Oh, we didn't do that one. We didn't do that scene. Oh, yeah, we did forget to get that one. That's fine. <laughs> Hi. Ooh. We're twins. Yay! Oh, flute, flute boy. boy. Plays again. And the old man's like, oh, oh God. Man. Shut up. <laughs> Be a tree, please. <laughs> Venus, queen of fairies. Is this the the big the big one? Or is this? <laughs> it's just a, it's just a, ooh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it's, it's, she's her. No, she's. Do you think she turns into the other fairy, the dark world fairy? Like when she eats too many hostess cupcakes. <laughs> just be like, in the dark world transformation. The dwarven swordsmith. <laughs> I like being a frog better. <laughs> The bug catching kid. Oh, they made a special thing just for him. Yeah. Looks like he's from South Park. <laughs> dot 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 dies. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, they haven't even showed him yet. No. There he there is. There he is. Oh, okay. I'm back! Oh, you gave him his net back. And I shit twin fun dipsticks. <laughs> <laughs> his parents were like, get that deadly hornet away from us! <laughs> I'll oh. never catch it! The lost old man. Yeah, thanks for remembering. <laughs> I'm still up here, alone. I'll, I've soothed your wounds many times. When I'll be pushing sharks me? later in <laughs> Wind Waker. Oh, there's one little Groucho guy. Oh, yeah. Yeah, what about it? I'm still in the forest. Fuck you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and, and the, the master sword. Oh, you gave it away? Yeah, see you later. Forever? Jeez. Yeah, I'm not so fucking sure about that shit. You think every so often, like, he gets Forever! Like, <laughs> or until 1996. <laughs> he gets into, a, like, a really shitty argument, and he's like, You know what?! And he just, like, runs off to the forest and pulls the magic sword out again. <laughs> I'm sick and tired of your bullshit! Not huh. bad. 007, baby. 
Sex bang. Daniel sex bang. <laughs> Take a notch, Dad. Fiend. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's fiend. Yeah. Oh, that was a great playthrough, man. Yeah, I'm glad I, we did I it. had wonderful fun. Me too. It was nice not playing something for a change. Yeah. Even though I really wanted to play Link to the Past. <laughs> yeah. So, thanks. Thanks, thanks, thanks for being a dick. See you later, everybody. I had a wonderful time. Me too. Love I, you guys. I hope you have a wonderful day. Not you, Dan, the audience. Okay. And I hope you all remember to brush your teeth. Please do. if you don't... It's important. You will get a bad case of gingivitis. Truth. And the plaque will create cavities. Yep. And that's no fun. You'll be biting into something and it'll hurt a lot. And, uh, well, there's no reversing that. <sighs> Next time on Game Grumps. <laughs> Boy, you sure know how to end the shit with a bang, bro. <laughs> We should just end every Game Grumps episode with, Wait, a, with like a, a dental PSA. public service message. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, fiend. <laughs> Thanks for joining us, and eat your peas. Bye, everybody. Well, we did it. That was marvelous. Another job well done. Thank you, Aaron. You're welcome. And the Game Grumps! How about pungent blood cocktail? I never use that That shit. sounds disgusting. Cool. That'll do it. Pungent blood cocktail. <laughs> I was just watching. I was just watching uh, Dane Cook do stand up, mm -hmm. and it just. Did you like it? I mean, it was all right. Okay. It wasn't like amazing or anything. Um, but um. like, <laughs> yeah, but it was just perfect because he was like, it was exactly the kind of shit that we did on the show. Like, oh it's, yeah. It's been amplified on this, on his stage performance now. So he's like, uh, he. <laughs> He did this bit where he's like, Girls, um, I don't like the word moist. <laughs> <Really>? Moist. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and then he's like, What don't you like about the word moist? And then the girl's like, Um, the oist. <laughs> 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 and it's just like, Oh, man. That's classic Dane. Yeah. Oh, the best. I hope he just like boils his set down to the point where he just comes out and he's like, Um, <laughs> mouth. <laughs> and then he walks off stage. <laughs> <laughs> well, I just like to imagine because like, you know, it's all based on it's really just how he says that shit like, Right. He does that bit because he says moist funny. Right, right, right. So there's like, no actual joke there I just imagine somebody like Steve Stephen Wright coming out and just being like Girls, they don't like the word moist and then, <laughs> that's, that's actually funnier, that's, I think. That's the joke. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's actually funnier. Yeah. <laughs> Stephen Wright, even in theory, is a better comedian. I still could not be that guy, like, you know, on the train or, like, in a line mm -hmm. that would, like, get up in somebody's face, you know? Yeah. It is astonishing the degree to w which I will put up with something. That is, unless I'm with other people, who are also suffering as the a result of someone's actions, then I'll be like, hey, you know, like I'll I'll make a move. Oh yeah. You I'm know what I'm saying? I think the only situation I've ever done that in is a movie theater situation. Yeah, I've had to tell it's, people because it's super easy to just be like, hey, shut up! Oh god, dude, I did it one time, like I remember so clearly. <laughs> and this is so you know me, this is not like me at all. It was just, I was so mad. It was the first Lord of the Rings movie. And, uh, I'd been waiting for years for that movie because they were my favorite books, uh, along with Last Unicorn, like, as a teenager. Um, and, uh, <laughs> there, there were some, there were some guys sitting behind me that were like, they clearly knew the books back to front, uh -huh. and they were just like, saying lines before the characters would say them. Like, like, it, 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 something ring to find them, like, a lot of people speak in, like, poetry in those books. Yeah. And then it's like, and then one ring to bind them. But, like, before he said it, the guy behind me was like, to bind them. And I was like, I turned around and I was just like, yo, shut the fuck up! And I was like, <laughs> my god, where did that even come from? <laughs> the jersey came out. Yeah, the jersey came out. Oh. So much nerd rage. Yeah, I- sometimes super fans can be more annoying than- than like just inconsiderate dudes. There's three guys following me right now. There is. Oh, it's because it was the third time I had to tell him. Oh, the first okay. two times I was like, um, dude, come on. And and the second time I was like, guys, seriously, I've waited a long time for this movie. 
and uh, the third time, busted out that <laughs> STFU. Oh, yeah. It I mean, felt great. What else are you gonna do? I, I think it's the only time I've ever said that to somebody. Le legitimately. I mean, yeah, <laughs> I say it to Ross on almost a daily basis. <laughs> I still have not to this day, because I'm always nervous that it's not the case. If you transport to Hunter's Dream and then back... Do you do, die for real? Do, yeah, <laughs> I know. I'm well, scared kinda, of it, too. I'm scared. Kind of, yeah. Like, do your blood echoes disappear? Oh. Um, so I'm gonna find that out right now, and I'm sure everybody at home who knows the answer is like, oh, They do slash don't. <laughs> <laughs> You're wasting my time. Oh. So, we'll see. But this is an interesting experiment. It is. It's an interesting experiment for me. And I guess maybe the two people who don't know the answer. In the end, it is said he left his secret with the lake. That means he pooped while he was swimming. <laughs> <laughs> I've always worried about... Mom, I left my secret with the lake! <laughs> Go and get it then! No! Not that closed. secret! <laughs> <laughs> oh, Mom. You don't understand me. I love and my you, desire buddy. to poop in every body of water in the world. I actually... Well, probably shouldn't say this because it's probably illegal to do in certain spots. What? But I, I did, I did have a goal. You really think there's like a cop watching that's gonna be like, "Oh, I'm waiting." Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, we died this whole ocean just waiting for someone to pee in it. Are those my echoes. They are my echoes. Nice. My goal was to pee in every uh, major body of water in the on Earth. Really? Um, yeah, yeah, like yeah. Like the, you mean the, like the oceans? Well, yeah, like Atlantic Ocean, Pacific Ocean, Mediterranean Sea, Black Sea, Dead Sea, I did, I did it all. I did it all, baby. Did you really? Yeah, Holy except the Dead Sea was super hard because like that's all salt and it doesn't sink. <laughs> Your pee floated? I don't, I don't remember how it went down, but it was just, it felt weird. It wasn't going anywhere. <laughs> 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 Wait, hold on. Yeah, go ahead. I want to know uh, everything. All the details. All right, so the Dead Sea in Israel is the lowest point on Earth. Right. Do you know this? I know. It is the saltiest body of water I knew that. in the world. Yeah. And there's nothing that can live in there other than, um, like these little shrimpy, shrimpy shrimps. Really? And like bacteria and oh, stuff like that. Oh, I bet like they're that. fucking delicious, like perfectly salted. <laughs> <laughs> they are not perfectly salted. They are wildly oversalted. <laughs> Well, I mean, that's, um, and it might not opinion. they it might not even be like that big an organism. It might just be bacteria, but you can get in there. You can get in there and you'll like float because it's um, it's it's just a different consistency than most water. It's really interesting. I'm huh. eating it. Well, yeah, yeah. Well, okay. I wanted the details of the peeing situation, not of the fucking. Okay. Okay. Lake fine. Itself. Fine. All right. All right. So <laughs> first. I took out my penis. I want to know all the details. <laughs> well, I live on a planet called Earth. Yeah. Uh, the population six mil billion or something. Yeah, six know. mil billion. <laughs> There's got to be at least six <laughs> mil billion people on this Earth. That's a Carl Sagan thing. There's uh, a mil mil billions, six mil bil bil mil billions, 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 <laughs> billions of millions of thousands of tens of people. <laughs> that reminds me of um. Barry showed you this last night, the fucking kid. The would you, did you ever have a dream, kid? I don't know. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> did you ever have a dream? Do you want? You could. You you had. You you <laughs> could. You want? You didn't. You couldn't. <laughs> I can't even remember what he's trying to get at, but like his super happy smile at the end. Oh my god, he's makes like, me feel so oh, good. He has the most like nailed it face. Yeah, that he's like, like got any it. Fucking child could have. Oh, I love him. I love him. <laughs> He doesn't actually have like a stutter or anything, right? He's God, just like he was just trying to think of shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I guess it is superb. Whoa, I've been in that situation Hello, before. Puppy. Oh, absolutely. I'm horrible at forming sentences. Do you remember like the first time you talked to like a really pretty girl when you were young, and you're just like, "Hi, hey, Jay. I was just wondering uh, uh, if you want. Uh, 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 just, um, do you do you like um." Do you like it? Do you like it when Rice Krispies like? Do you like you know there's like the one like brown Rice Krispie because it got like hot in the machine and like cooked too much? Do you do you eat, do you eat that? I gotta go. <laughs> Dude, to be perfect. Do you want to go to prom? <laughs> yeah. I mean, if it's not too much, I don't know because you know and. I don't, I'm just, you know, it, it's like in your head, it's oh, so to clear. Totally, totally. Um, no, I don't, you, you should be honest, I don't remember much from being a kid. I remember like feelings. Really? I don't remember like scenes. Well, I get that, I guess it's the opposite. I don't remember like the specifics. I don't remember like what I said to people. 
Well, you and I have very different brains. You know, if like doing the show together for what, almost two years now has definitely like taught us one thing. It's that, you know, you and I like we think about things differently. We remember things differently. Like yeah. it's it's interesting because, you know, you'll be like, how do you fucking remember a f the score of a football game you saw like 30 years ago? And I'm like. Oh, you mean Giants Cowboys uh, in 1988 at Giants Stadium, 29 to 21? <laughs> I don't know why I remember shit like that, but yeah. and it's not like I have a photographic memory because other shit, like people will say something to me and I'll forget it, like 30 seconds later. Yeah. Oh, definitely. So I mean, I don't know. It's it's just, but I, you know, you just sort of naturally assume that everyone experiences life the way you do, but like. Yeah, definitely. But sometimes people will, like, I'll say something from my past and people will be like, What the f- are you fucking serious? You remember that? Yeah. Yeah, totally. It's weird. I, I just remember feelings. That's yeah. all- that's all I remember is like- and locations. Mm. Locations are really- th which is weird because I never became like a- like a painter or anything like that, you know? Right. I well, like I mean, you were- you always had an artistic eye, so you just- you were more aware of your environment. I guess so. I don't Probably. Know. It's because I always had, like, vivid dreams about locations, I don't know. Oh, man. I, uh, well, you know what? Let's talk about our, our, our dreams and, and, uh, and memories and feelings and, uh, and locations on the next Game Grooms. Okay. You have 44,000 blood echoes, my friend. Yeah, that's why I'm running back to oh, okay, you, you are going. Okay. We don't want that, uh, that 53,000 debacle that we had before. <laughs> that was a debacle. <laughs> There's no other fucking word for it. It was a, it's, it's, it's... One of the very few times that I read the comments, um, recently, mm -hmm. and it was like, it was just like, Dan told you <laughs> in the last episode! Oh man, that's so funny. Yeah. I, the, you know, you know how like, certain people say things, uh, in certain situations, and like, when you encounter that situation, you kind of pretend that person's there and you can just hear their voice? Yeah. Like, there, there is like a... Something you do like a, no, no, like that. <laughs> kind of thing. And whenever like you're about to lose echoes, I'm like, oh, here it comes. <laughs> That's a great impression of me. It's really funny. <laughs> no, no. Oh, it's, oh, just, it's, oh. it's so honest. It's such, it's from such a sad, honest place. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it all just comes rushing in, like, oh, and he told me, and oh, it just didn't. Oh, I uh, knew it. I knew it. And everything. yeah, because it's not just like the sadness in the moment; it's the, it's the regrets of the past and the dreading of the future, like what you're gonna hear from people, like because you fucked up. That's actually the first time that I ever felt like that twinge of like, because you know, it's one thing for somebody to be like. You know what? You're really good at that, you know. But it's another thing to like do something and then get that immediate reaction of like, "Whoa, you are amazing at that!" Right. You know. Right. And that was the first time I ever got that in my life. Was I? I was like five or six or something. Yeah. And I just did like a normal whistle, and it was super loud. Really. And my parents were like, "Whoa, that's a crazy good whistle!" And I was like, "Yeah, yeah, I know." <laughs> Thank you, mother and father. You know, I, I was the exact opposite. Like I. I somehow got it in my head that if, um, if you took credit for anything, like, you were arrogant or uh -huh. something like that. So, <laughs> this is true, actually. I, I won a, an art contest when I was, like, 11 years old, um, for, like, this drawing I, I did of a stegosaurus. It was for, uh, PBS. It was for Channel 13. Uh -huh. And, um, and so, like, the picture, like, it was original, like, I just thought of it and then did it but when it got chosen to like be on tv and everything they did an interview of me uh and they were like where did you get the idea for this painting and i th i thought it was rude or wrong to say like oh, i just thought of it so i was just like i just copied it out of a book <laughs> and my mom and dad are like oh my god <laughs> <laughs> you are on tv right now <laughs> It's funny, man. Wow, really? It's totally true. Oh, man. It's totally true. I was like, I thought I thought I was being a dick by, like, taking credit for it. I don't... Oh. Yeah. Isn't that sad? That's really interesting. <laughs> I know. My mom still has that painting. She framed it and she put it in her house. 
Well, this is where I was. So, like, there are these really nice works of professional art, and then this fucking derpy 11-year-old Stegosaurus <laughs> painting. But that's the one she's proudest of, that she's like, that's Aww. my little blue ribbon winner. You copied that out of a book. <laughs> yeah, I, well, I told her this, the truth later. Huh. That's, a, like, that's interesting. Yeah. I, I was pretty... <laughs> That conversation came up from the fact that I acted like I responded to it going like, Yeah, that's fuck right I did, but right. that's not how I actually reacted. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was just making a joke. Uh, I was just kind of like, oh, thank you. <laughs> you know. Um, oh, neat. neat. I, I've, I've always wanted your love. But I mean, yeah. Life is, uh... It's a repeated endless kick to the nuts. <laughs> <laughs> and then when you think you got the hang of it, like... Life is like, hey, I got these new boots I'd like to try out on your nuts. <laughs> and you're just kind of like, well, is it, yeah, I but, guess this is the arrangement. Yeah, but I'm like, no, I can see it coming because I've been through Cats. this. Oh, darn it. I've been through this before so I can avoid this nut kick. And life's like, actually, I've also been training in this new form of <laughs> nut karate. So I'll kick you in a way you've never even considered uh, being kicked before. And then... Uh, you get the steel-toed boots right, right to the 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 taint region, <laughs> where where the taint meets the heart. Oh man! And it gets like, every so often he's like he he like switches it up with a flick. Yeah, just and a little. Bit. That's that's the worst. Because getting kicked in the nuts is like, all right, just do it, just do it. Yeah, but like a no. flick is like, no, ooh, yeah. no. When I can feel it already. Ugh, when they graze the nuts, that's <laughs> that is a nightmare. Have you ever had the the real life nut kick or or nut whatever, um, discomfort, where you actually do raise your voice a little bit? Oh yeah, <laughs> of course, dude. Getting kicked in the nuts is not. It's not an event, it's a process. <laughs> like, there's so much to it. Like, first, first you're like, the, first there's the immediate wave of pain. Yeah, right. And then, like, that weird, like, oh shit, is more pain coming? And then the pain, like, redoubles, like, oh, yeah. 50 times more and comes and hits you way harder. And then you double over, and then you get short of breath, and then you get a headache, and then you can't see color. And then fucking, you may never have children. Jesus. Yeah. Did you- did you get like a log to the nuts? <laughs> what- oh fuck, what happened? Oh my god. I definitely I definitely took a nut shot that I can still- Like if I really were to meditate on it, I could go back to that place and- and feel it again. I am sorry for that nut oh, shot. Oh, it was a baseball. I took a baseball to the nuts. Like- like a- like a pitched baseball? Uh, yeah, a pitched and then hit by the bat baseball. Ooh! Like line driven. Ooh! Yeah, into the nuts. That is like- that, that is sheer no hesitation of- Speed and oh, velocity. Yeah. And I stopped playing baseball in like sixth grade, so this must have happened a good like 25 years ago, and yet I remember it like it was yesterday. <laughs> it's like fucking uh, wave wipe transition back to your flashback. That's how it went down, man. <laughs> Wait, well, you know what? I was gonna say we haven't done an improv sentence in a long time, but maybe I'll do it when you're not getting shot at and attacked by lycanthropes. <laughs> Whoops! <laughs> like, Pardon like, me, good sir. Like, I can't handle it. Alright. Once. I can't handle it! Okay. It's too much! Alright. Ah, oh, I'm getting shot at by blood bullets and shit! This is not how you play the game, Aaron. You're just one word. I'm sorry. Alright, alright. Okay. I'll do it when I'm fighting the boss. Don't. I, I no. I, I was went, starting a sentence. I, I went wasn't the wrong like. Way. Oh, okay. God. <laughs> I I thought I was going the right way, but I went the wrong way. Okay, go, go ahead. Okay. Tina Turner. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Ah no! All right, go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> Was that the end of our first sentence? Yeah, Tina yeah, Turner? Th that was the whole sentence. Okay. Tina Turner. Here we go, do it. Alright. I was walking to the store. And finally, I said, Hey, what's in the store? So, then I told my friend who is stupid that one of my 
deepest fears is to walk on a Sherpa. <laughs> I don't know where that came from. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. I'm not positive. I'm pretty sure a Sherpa is a guide that will take you up a mountain. <laughs> yes. So one That's would not. Exactly what a Sherpa. One is. would not walk on a Sherpa. <laughs> and certainly, it would not register as one's deepest fears. I haven't thought about a Sherpa. Mm-hmm. In like six years, I only think about them because of fucking Team America World Police, where he's trying to like ingratiate himself with the terrorists. Uh huh. And he's, oh, he's like, like Sherpa Derpa. Yeah, and he's like Durka Durka, Muhammad Jihad, Haka Sherpa Sherpa. <laughs> and they're like, Oh, Durka Durka Durka. Here, let's do another one. <laughs> that is a funny movie. Let's do it. Let's do another one. Oh, okay. Um. One, two, three. <laughs> Mayhaps that might have not been our best work as improv artists. Uh, uh, thank you to the average of 200,000 people that watch us do this every day. And are happy about it. Thank you. We can't thank you enough. <laughs> which is why we're working so hard to raise our game. <laughs> I was listening to, just thinking of kids, I was listening to Mark Marin. Yeah. Um, do you know, you know him? Yeah. The, the comedian, he's really fucking funny. Um, he, he was talking about, I always feel bad whenever I talk about comedians' bits on, on the show, but... Go check out Mark Marin. There. Now it's fair. He's got the What the Fuck podcast. Yes, the WTF. And, uh... He was talking about um, how the girl he's with now wants to have kids, and he's like, you know, I'm such a nervous, panicky guy that the only two states of thought that I can have with regards to a baby are like, oh man, having a baby, that seems like a beautiful thing. And then his mind goes right to, it's dead! <laughs> <laughs> Like, he'll fuck it up somehow and kill the baby. <laughs> like, oh, what a, what a treasure that, that, that God has given us, uh, and a, a little me, and I can share all, my life with him. It's not breathing! <laughs> it's, it's so fucking funny. Uh, do you think if Juicy Juice made, like, a jello, it would be Goopy Goop? Yeah, why not? Yeah. Good question. 100% juice for... All the goop in the world. <laughs> is that their terrible slogan? Yeah. Yeah. Well, their slogan is 100% juice for 100% kids, but I think that's extremely limiting. <laughs> <laughs> because I enjoy Juicy Juice, yeah. and I'm a fucking adult. And what about a kid that's, like, missing a finger? Like, and is only, like, 97% kid. <laughs> it's really fucking... I'm not 100% kid! Yeah. I wish I was! Thanks for reminding me, Jello! <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I wish we were being paid for this. No, we're not. <laughs> we are most certainly not. Not I mean, by Jello. Uh, well, Juicy Juice. Oh, th Juicy that's what Juice I meant. Juicy Juice is a company. Juicy Juice. I got confused. I just want to start. I just want to start like a uh, one of our playthroughs, like you know, like one of those fucking walkthroughs that we're always watching, where it's like. Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Aaron from Game Grumps. Uh, we're gonna talk about the, uh, the One Reborn. That's a really easy <laughs> fight. We're gonna have to just walk over here. You know, you don't wanna even fight him at the beginning. You just wanna, just wanna run up these stairs really quick, uh, watch your stamina. Everything's good. <laughs> uh, actually, uh, you, you might have noticed in the, in the opening cutscene, uh, these creatures right here, they actually, uh, uh, summoned the One Reborn, and you, you actually have to take them out. Now, usually, uh, you can just kill them in, in, in two hits. Uh, depending on your on your on your leveled up and everything, but every so often they'll they'll fall off. Now I, oh I didn't I didn't make that one fall off, but uh, <laughs> you know maybe in this next one uh, I'll 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 have a chance so you can see. But usually the, the the fall damage will take them out. It's almost like I'm not laughing because <laughs> your fucking impression is so on the nose. <laughs> it just feels like I'm listening to the walkthrough again. <laughs> God damn. <laughs> Uh, now once these once these oh, women are all dead, uh, you're gonna want to go down down there and, and, and you know to be sure this is actually a really easy fight. Um, yeah, they they love to like 
uh, say how easy it is after you you've clearly struggled otherwise why would you be watching their <laughs> fucking walkthrough oh man uh. I did this uh, while I was uh, asleep and I had herpes in my eye <laughs> Uh, I was I couldn't see I was blind for three days, but I did this anyway because I mean it's just that easy Frankly when you're this good um, <laughs> To be sure I did have eye herpes to be uh, sure uh, unquestionably herpes. It will never go away I have it in my eyes for the rest of my life, Jesus. but I still beat the one remorn in like two seconds uh, Very easy very easy fight very uh, easy. one of one of One of the most embarrassing losses if you if you manage to get to that point yeah, if you lose to this, uh, you should, probably should relinquish uh, parental control of any children you may have, because uh, you are an unfit father, uh, obviously. Mm. A nice spicy t tomato. Little Fucking pico, hate tomatoes. Pico de gallo, basically. basically. Yeah. You you hate tomatoes? It's pronounced. First of all, it's pronounced pico de gallo. <laughs> and secondly, yes, I hate. To I've always hated. Oh tomatoes. my god, really? Yeah. Oh. You knew that about me. D I didn't. You've never seen me pick tomatoes off of anything with tomatoes. I I guess not. Yeah. I mean, I'll no, eat them. No no no, like, no 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 oh. no! Let me tell you more about tomatoes while. Uh, Please do. Well, well, Dude, I mean, it's easy. Well, Getting here is so easy. I don't have to fucking... Okay. I, and you know what? I haven't shown how to get here, like, shortcut-wise. So you're, I'll, I'll... You're probably right. You're, you're, you're really doing them a favor, if anything, <laughs> our audience. Well, that, I they'll hear more appreciate about, it. I want to hear more about feel you. Free, feel free to let us know of your appreciation of Aaron showing you how to get back to this boss in the comments. Dude. It, 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 you, I know I'm psyched. Dude, <laughs> I want to tell you. Yeah. In this, in this period of time. Okay. Uh, since there's not much to point out. Right. What the fuck? Anyway. Oh shit, I'm out of fucking blood vials. Whatever, I can do this. You cannot- what? I can do this. <laughs> you just- I'm not out of blood vials, oh. I just don't have a whole lot of them. Anyway. Are you sure this is a good idea? This is my tomato story. Okay. Uh, I didn't like hamburgers with stuff on them. Right. I just liked hamburgers with ketchup. When right. I was a kid. And then one day, like ten years ago maybe, Mm -hmm. I decided I was one like one fateful frosty December mid morning. <laughs> Pretty much. Yeah. I was on the way to work or something at, at Blockbuster. Right. And there's a Burger King outside, and I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna get like a burger. Like, fuck it. I hate fucking requesting and looking like an asshole. I'm just gonna be like, right. one Whopper, please. One non high maintenance Whopper. <laughs> and, uh, and I ate it, and I was like, dang, I think I like the toppings now. Whoa. Yeah, so. But I was like, uh, tomato, I don't know. But then I started reading about tomato, and it was like, oh, tomato's in season. Like, there's seasons for it. And then when it's out of season, uh, it's, it's gross and goopy. And I was like, okay, so I don't like the gross and goopy tomato, but I like the in-season tomato. What is the season? Uh, summer, I believe. No shit. Yeah. So, Are you like, kidding me? So, so we could literally have three months of non-disgusting tomatoes in our future? Well, here's here's... Here's the end of my story. Yeah, it was Burger King, so you barfed anyway. <laughs> <laughs> For a while, right. I was like, uh, okay, so I only like tomatoes when they're in season. Okay. And then I started getting tomatoes only when they were in season. And then I realized I just don't like tomatoes. Oh, <laughs> uh, well, yeah, there's the rub. It's like, wait a minute, these are still fucking tomatoes. Yeah, they're, they're, to be fair, mm -hmm. they are much better when they are in season. Okay, cool. But still not good. Yeah, I'm not in- not huge into them. So, why when I said I didn't like tomatoes, you were like, you don't like tomatoes? I didn't- I didn't know. Oh. Most people like tomatoes. Oh, I see. So it was surprise and not shock and horror. I'm yeah, with you. Yeah, no. I'm down with the hating tomatoes. I'm down with- if, there, if there's one thing that I can be negative about, it is tomatoes. Yeah. If- if there's two things I'm down with, it's hating tomatoes and the sickness. <laughs> not even in that order. And getting up and g coming on. Oh, sure. And then getting down. Right, uh, obviously. With, with, specifically with the six. So, yeah. <laughs> you mother, get up. <laughs> you, that you always, female birther of a child. That always struck me as weird that, like, for no reason in the middle of that song, he's like, you mother, get up! <laughs> get down with the sickness! Well, I think, I think he's trying to say, like, you mother effer. Yeah, maybe it was a radio edit. <laughs> I don't know why I was... Censoring, censoring yourself on a non-censored program. <laughs> yes. oh, I was... think he was saying the F word, Dan. <laughs> I mean, this is Game Grump, so we're not gonna say fuck, obviously, but... Alright, so, Bloodborne, uh, we're back. Uh, Aaron and I took a little break, and we both have something to say. Mm -hmm. uh, 
Mine was that uh, Susie purchased some uh, Velveeta cheesy bowls yeah. for us. But uh, something about the font they used really makes it look like it says cheesy bowels. <laughs> and, really? Uh, that, that tickles me. I was like, yes, <laughs> one of those, please. Did you make it? No, no, I am. Um, you, you didn't want cheesy bowels. My bowels are cheesy enough, thank you. <laughs> oh. Whoa. And what was the thing you were going to say? I, well, I walked in here and you were like, I love unironically terrible videos. Oh, yeah. Just like, you know. Uh, it sounds mean to say it on the show now. But like, well, they don't know what you're talking about. You know, you know, when you see. I mean, we talked about a Mickey Mouse capade. You know when you see like a, a dude that's just like trying really hard and it's just not working out <laughs> but they do it for like like 70 episodes <laughs> <laughs> like each episode has less views than the last oh no and it's just like oh man i love that shit for some reason it's super inspiring wow that's so weird <laughs> because it's just like your description was like, oh, hey, what are you doing here, President Santa? <laughs> yeah, just like, hey, what's up, everybody? I'm a guy named Greg. Uh, today uh, on Greg Plays, we're going to we'll look at a, a game called uh, Sassy Frassy Passy Bassy. Uh, no, that's not what it's called. It's called Dandy Fanny Sandy Pandy. Uh, oh, what's wrong again? Oh, Mr. President Santa, you're really you're really getting my goat now. Well, yes, I am, Greg Gamer. I'm and it's yeah, like, people, oh, people man. People can't see your sock puppet hand motion. <laughs> but, I, whoa, what was that? Who's uh, shooting you? It's just an evil lady up there shooting frenzy arrows at me from all sides. What a biznatch. Yeah. Oh. Uh, this area is Remember pretty... when people used to call each other biatches? <laughs> oh, yeah. It's a biatch. It's a biatch. Remember when people used to say, what's up? Oh, I yeah, yeah, that. yeah. It was right around the same time. I remember the first time I heard bizitch. Bizitch? <laughs> They're like, what's up, bizitch? And I was like, my God, the future is now. Is that like Snoop Dogg type stuff? No, it was a white kid playing They're frisbee. Like Sniggity dizzity. <laughs> that still, kind of thing. Sniggadizzle. Sniggadizzle. My name's Snoop Dizzity Dog. Did, why, why did Snoop say nizzle dizzle stuff like that? Was it. Was it to get around censors, uh, or just because he because was like a branding a, thing? A lazy rhymer. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, for rizzle, my nizzle, I got a dizzle on the pizzle, and it's like, yeah, I guess I could just interpret that however I choose. Yeah, I mean, I get what you're trying to say, and technically it all rhymed. <laughs> technically it all rhymed. Yeah. <laughs> I put some brez, I put some brezel in my tozel, <laughs> and then I pozzle down the the what is it like a. Oh, hello, Prezzadizzle Santizzle. <laughs> what are you doing, Hizzle? Well, I think the reason I like him so much is because it's like a, a reminder that, like, it, it kind of is hard to be, like, likable and make a good show, you know? Oh, God. We fucking fail at it every day. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, totally. Because, like, you, you do it and you do it for so long and you're just kind of like, you know, man, this isn't, like, a big deal. You know, we're just... We were just doing it, and that's what we do. No, this isn't a big deal. I'm just fighting a couple worms. They won't kill me. <laughs> oh, wait. You died. Yeah. But then you see somebody who's unironically bad at it, and you're like, oh, okay, I get it. Like, I guess this is sort of a skill. This is coming off like a humble brag. Uh, what we're trying <laughs> to say is, like... No, we- I'm just trying to justify why I would- I would be mean like that. <laughs> is all I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> it's because I'm so great that it's fun to be an asshole. No. I mean, you know what I'm talking about, right? It's like I, when you watch The Room. Yes, yes, of course. Everybody, everybody, it's a very human And it's thing. like, this is a horrible movie. Yeah. But I love it. I love watching it. It's yes. unironically bad. I love how horrible it is. Like, if The Room was intentionally bad, then it wouldn't be as funny. Although I have had experiences in my life with, with girls where, like, I wanted to put my fists to the air and be like, You're tearing me apart! <laughs> I mean, it, it does happen. That would be super liberating. That that was that was the... Maybe maybe next time I find myself in that situation. Yeah. I'll just... I'll, instead of thinking it, I'll actually do it. And then, and then after you tell me that story, I'll be like, Oh, hi, Dan. How's your sex life? <laughs> Does he ask that question? Yeah, you never see, you ever seen the room? I've seen. Oh, I saw parts of it, but I couldn't fucking watch the whole thing. Oh man. Well, because I watched that podcast. How did this get made? And so, like every time they do uh, a movie, I, I try to watch the movie first before listening to the podcast. Oh, gotcha. And uh, they did that one, and I know I must have mentioned this on the show before because it feels familiar. But they they describe the sex scene in it, 
and he's kind of ripped a little bit, but yeah. in a gross, weird way. Mm -hmm. And they described him as looking like an 80s action figure that was put in the microwave for 30 <laughs> yeah, seconds. Yeah, you did mention that. <laughs> I think this is one of the best games released in a long time. Really? Yeah, like, like top five for like the last 10 years. No shit, yeah. dude. Wow. I'd say so. Well, I'm maybe surprised to hear you say that. Ten years is a pretty long time. I'd That's say five years. Long ass time. Pac-Man was in the last ten years. <laughs> Tetris? Yeah. Really, Tetris? Uh, it's Tetris. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh. I'm just always trying to. I feel like if it was Tetris, it wouldn't have become as popular a game. Frankly. Tetris. Tetris. Well, because it's like Tetra. There's four of them. Oh, my God. What? You just blew my fucking mind. I never put that together. Yeah, there's there's four blocks in each piece. Oh my oh my god. <laughs> yeah, man. Oh Jesus. No, no, there's there's five in some No, you're no, right. Oh all my four. god. Oh my god. It's, I'm, it's, I'm, hold on, I'm cycling through them all in my mind. It's every configuration you could possibly make with four squares being adjacent to each other. Oh Jesus Christ, you're right. Oh my god. Yeah. My I mean, brain is like. <laughs> <laughs> that's why that game's so fucking genius, man. Wow. I mean, just one of the reasons. Yeah, that's why they all fit together too, I guess. Yeah, there you go. Holy crap. Yeah, dude. Um, Matthew Matosis did a video on, on about about that. Matthew Matosis? Yeah, he's. I hope he recovers from that. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds really debilitating. Oh fuck! This guy's throwing rocks at me. I don't need that. I need that in my life. Yeah. Uh, get out of get out of my life. Matthew bro. Matos is, is one of my favorite uh, video creators. Is he? Yeah. Never heard of him. He's um I've talked about him before, but I I, I didn't mention him by <laughs> Sorry, name. I wasn't listening. No 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 I didn't mention him by name. That's why you're confused. Oh okay. I cool. mentioned him as like the Irish guy that does video game things. Oh yeah yeah yeah. Um okay, cool. he's super fucking smart and he's the only thing. <laughs> this is getting like deep. Uh huh. Um deep it out, bro. Shit. Anytime we're on, like, episode 50-something of, uh, a playthrough, we're allowed to get deep. Yeah. The- the only thing, uh, about Matthew Matosis, and it's not him, it has nothing to do with him. Mm -hmm. It's that since he does stuff that's similar to mine, mm -hmm. and mine is, like, sequelitis is sort of, like, like, pretty popular. Right. Um, they get compared. But, like, it's never, it's never, like, this, like, level-headed, like, totally cool, like, well, you know what, like, Eager Raptor does it like this, and Matthew Matosis does it like right, this. Right, of course. It's like, this is way superior to sequel, yeah, you know, like, yeah, because, yeah, because he's, course. like, not as popular, and, like, they're better. Well, and... that's, that's the fucking, like, so that's I... always the weirdest thing, like. Yeah. But I, it's like, it's because I love his stuff and I totally agree with that mentality. Yeah. But it's like, I can't read that. Like, I wanted to read the comments to see, like, what people were saying about, like, his analysis and stuff. And then it's just like, fuck Ego Raptor. And I'm yep. like, no. Yep. <laughs> I love these videos. Don't poison them for me. Well, I mean, like, that, that, that happens all the time for us. Like, you get compared to your friends. Yeah. And it makes you feel weird. Like, like, even going back to, um, to when, uh, to when John left the show, like, it was, like, everyone was, like, John's better than Danny, or Danny's better than John, like, relentlessly, yeah. like, for months, and, like, both of us, we'd talk about it, we'd be, like, this feels weird, man, like, it feels <laughs> weird to read, like, your friend is better than you, or you're better than your friend, yeah. like, neither one feels good, No, and it's just, like, but people think, like, they're defending your honor, which is nice, and it's flattering, but man, like, the- the- the human side behind it is very awkward. Yeah, it really is. Yeah. I feel like there- there could be a really interesting, like, book written on- <laughs> That was cute, he was like, I think I'll just sit down here. <laughs> oh. oh, maybe I'll just throw my arm up it kinda, casually. It kinda looks like he's got a big smile. Hi! Hi! Oh! Good go for a good snug right now. Yeah, you want to uh, snuggle up? Or like, or it's oh, like, oh, it's too jiggly. It's grossing <laughs> me out. It's grossing me out. It's like one of those things where like he got he got hurt, like his leg got hurt or something, but he sort of like like yeah. fell down like coolly. Yeah, he's and trying he's to like, play it off. Yeah, no, no, no big deal. Right here, you guys go on, and then he tries to get it's up. Cool. It's like, <laughs> and he's like, ah! <laughs> no, no, it just tickles, man. Wait, before we end this episode, what were you gonna say about a book? Oh, somebody should write a book on, like, on that sort of... I feel like 
it's new enough mm-hmm. that there's no literature on that. That I've I've looked up a couple books on um like internet culture and like uh how sort of like social media has changed how we interact with people. Right. But they're all I don't feel like they really get to the heart of like what it feels like to be in that environment, you know? I mean, because it's a different feeling. Like if you, if you. By the way, I'm just I'm running in circles because of this shit. So I'm not gonna. Oh Jesus I'm not, I'm not Christ! Gonna, I'm not gonna go deep on acceptable reason. <laughs> um, yeah, that guy's like, fuck it, I'm going. Because <laughs> <laughs> um, it's like a different feeling, right? Like you get you get bullied on the schoolyard or whatever. <laughs> that guy just said the same. Like, <laughs> yeah. whoa. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'll finish the thought next time I get Rose. Okay, next time I get Rose. <laughs> That's a big ass spider. <laughs> Woo! They reuse enemies, but they do it very sparingly. Mm-hmm. Like every area has new shit, and it just feels like a new place. Right. An interesting place. I fucking love it, man. Ten I out like of it ten. too. Ten out of ten. Ten out of ten, really? Ten out of ten. You're giving this game a ten. An AGN ten for the for the amount of fun. That's the Aaron Game News Network. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what's up, everybody? I'm Aaron from the Aaron Game News Network. Uh, today we're gonna be reviewing Bloodborne for the PS4. Ten out of ten. One of my favorite games uh, that's come out this year. Probably the best game ever. Like the stamp comes in like shoo. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. But don't take my word for it. Even though I'm gonna explain to you in my <laughs> own words. Yeah, even though you'll my words are what you'll be taking. Let's hop right in to the review. Yeah. And then and then it, and then the review starts where where I'm like using a different microphone with a different energy. Yeah. Okay, so welcome. What <laughs> we're gonna do here? <laughs> uh, that's like my favorite uh, game reviewer trope. What's that? Like, hey everybody, I'm here. Blah 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 blah. And uh, the, uh, we'll just hop right into the review. Here we go. Bloodborne is a game <laughs> that was invented by the ancients in the ancients. 1785. Like, it's just, it's such a different energy and feel. Yeah, and just vibe. like recorded on different weeks. <laughs> yeah, with like different amphetamines in the body. Right, right. He just went through like some kind of recent physical trauma. <laughs> He's like doing the voiceover from like a hospital bed. <laughs> <laughs> oh, here I am. Oh, jeez, yeah. I once um, I once got really into this. I get. Well, oh, it yeah. looked like they were like grabbing at him. The little <laughs> guys <laughs> like. Yeah, 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 yeah. I once got really into this. Um, you'll never find him, so I don't feel bad talking about it. Okay. But I uh, I once got into like this reviewer, who like, he w- he was just kind of like low energy. Uh huh. And it was and it was really fun to watch him because he was actually pretty informative about like the things that he said. Sure. Um, but like as his videos went on, he it it seemed like he just got like sicker. <laughs> oh, no. And I invented like this horribly sad story. Oh for him. no! But I think he just like I Oof. think he was just losing weight. <laughs> like <laughs> oh, okay. But for some reason, I was like, oh man, like. Dude, is he gonna make it to the next video? Oh my <laughs> like, god, it's so sad! <laughs> Jeez, Aaron. Yeah. Gosh. He's cool. Uh, <laughs> he was one of my favorites. I haven't seen his videos in a long time. Back to black, baby! Oh god, here we go again. This what mother. is that crouching fellow? It's like the guy that sucks your brains out. Is it? Yeah, see how he's like all twitchy? Ooh, yeah. So, ah, oh, fuck. Oh, he- Aaron! Oh, he's actually really easy. He Whoa. spotted you. <laughs> he sees you! <laughs> he sees you! <laughs> like, as you're slicing up his corpse. <laughs> He's Run- almost upon you! <laughs> Run away! <laughs> like, after I've killed him. Yeah. For God's sake! <laughs> He's everywhere! What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> oh, good times. Alright, I gotta get back to a fucking lantern, cause, man, fuck this joint. Yeah. Like Agreed. a- like a- like a blunt, you know what I'm saying? You don't fuck those, Aaron. You smoke them. No, I mean like... Yeah. <laughs> Do you know what a blunt is, Aaron? No, I don't. Do you really not? No, well, yes, a blunt is a- is a marijuana. Uh, but what kind? Like, how is it presented and prepared? Rolled in paper? Close. What kind of paper? Uh... 
You're getting your education, so when next time when we're on the streets and someone asks you a bunch of drug facts and they're like, are you cool? Are you a fucking narc? You won't be like, uh, no, I love marijuana cigarettes, you know? <laughs> but wouldn't it be more genuine if I was just like, dude, I don't, I don't know, I don't smoke. Maybe it would be. Maybe it would be. Alright, a joint is, uh... What, what kind of paper? A, jo a joint is cigarette paper. Okay. Like when you free when you roll your own cigarettes and stuff like that. A blunt is cigar paper. Really? Yeah. So you unroll a cigar, you dump out all the tobacco and stuff in there, known as the guts. I shouldn't be teaching our audience how to <laughs> make a blunt, but whatever, it's out there. Um, uh -huh. And uh, then you place the weed inside, and then you roll it up into a uh, a marijuana cigar, and then you get. <laughs> really high. Like, Absolutely wow. Absolutely fast. Like, forget your own fucking name and face high. Oops! Yeah. You got shot. We were just watching Super Slumber Party with our <laughs> boys Stamper and Oni. Super Slumber Party! Blow my dad and cry! <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's a classic, man. It's still funny, fucking three years later. To this day. We love them to so. To this day. Do they know that we love them? They must. Of course they do. They better. I'll Just kill him if they don't know. Stamper's like a bro to me. He's like he's he's a dear bro. Yeah, like a like a like a persona kind of thing. Yeah, exactly. Like oh, he's a deer bro. Yeah, that he's no. A, I just meant he's a like like he drives John Deere tractors. Oh, I see. Yeah, he's a deer bro. <laughs> like he's a fucking like other kin, like a deer other kin. I don't even know what that means. An other kin means like you know how like. Someone can identify as like uh, like a female instead of when when they're actually a male. I oh oh okay. I yeah. never heard the term. So an other kin is when you identify as like an animal, oh. or, or like an actual person. Oh, instead of like an opposite gender. Weird. Yeah. So, well, I shouldn't say weird. So but there are people different. that are like I'm a dragon other kin. <laughs> so, wow. Yeah. And they, we're talking about people that know they're humans, right? I guess? Like, I don't know. I've never- I've never met an other kin. I've never- like, that's what or I don't- at least talked about other kin with an other kin. I don't understand the word identify, like, in- in that context. Like, do you think- do you actually believe you're a dog, or do you just like dogs so much that you're like, I'm a dog? I have no idea, dude. Alright. I'm gonna- I, I gotta do some research. Gotta do some research, yeah. Pause the episode. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't- I don't know, man. Yeah. Uh, maybe I should just- maybe I should go otherkin for a while. Why not? Yeah. Fucking- Try it out. I've been a human a long time. Yeah, fuck it. I'd rather be a fucking- I'd rather be a fucking unicorn. Yeah. Oh my god, and then you could have sex with a human girl and you could be like, Oh god, I don't normally date out of my species, but... <laughs> you're just so special, I figured it was worth it. <laughs> like, what would you- what would you be? What would be your animal? I think you said it. it I think I'd be a unicorn. unicorn. Yeah. 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 All right. Or, or, or like, like if, as far as real animals, probably like a like a dolphin or a deer. A dolphin? Why a dolphin? They're they're nice. They're they're intelligent and they're sweet. Aren't they very sexually aggressive? Well, some <laughs> <laughs> apparently. I don't know. All right. Like I'll, if, I'll, if you see a dolphin, it's either I'll just like, go with deer. Then I'll go with deer. It's either like gonna be your friend or it's gonna be like your assaulter. Yeah. Yeah. It's gotcha. gonna be like problems for you in the future for like years to come. Alright, we'll go with, with big horned elk. Whoa. These guys are kinda hard. Hit their eyes, like, the blue eyes, like, moving in the dark, like, are really cool the way it leaves trails and stuff. They glow with the blue of my 1998 Yaris. Back in my- <laughs> <laughs> Back in, um, back in my college days. We used to smoke pot, and then, like, the raver kids that would do ecstasy would come in, and, uh, they would, like, do, like, a crazy raver light show for us, where they were holding, like, the little, like, LED lights and doing crazy things with them. Yeah. And so, like, and we'd, we'd just be stoned, so they'd look amazing. And then, they would be on E, so they had crazy holes in their brains. Anyway, look at that chandelier. Every time I do it, it makes me cheer. <laughs> <laughs> look at that chandelier! <laughs> <laughs> oh god! Oh god. Make contact. 
Um, are you ready for some fucking shit? Hold on. Fuck. Yeah. Press Should we button. save it for next time on Game Grumps? Or? No, 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 no. Okay. We can do it right now. All right. I'm gonna hang out with my friend. He's a pretty ballerina. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Here we go. <laughs> oh, jeez. I thought this was the front of him. <laughs> Making content near far wherever you are. I believe that my heart will go on. What kind of pose is this? It's my favorite pose. I, it's really... I'm gonna throw up. <laughs> <laughs> the first time I fucking... Because it's so stressful up to this point, and then you're just like, <laughs> Really? <laughs> really? This is what I came here for? Yeah, I think I'm gonna beat him. Yeah. Do you want, do you want to do it? Wait till you're on camera? I can't, I can't pause it. Yay! Yay! Okay! <laughs> yeah, 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 we yeah, did yeah. it! Oh. Whoa! Whoa. Yeah. Oh, okay. I don't know my own strength! <laughs> Aaron was like, man, I don't have any blood vials on me. Maybe I'll just play this guy off camera and get my bearings about me. And then you just fucking wrecked him. <laughs> Jesus, man, when there's like no... Uh. <laughs> there's like no stakes. It's yeah, just exactly. like, okay, fine, whatever. Man. The game grumps. Well, welcome back. He looked so easy that time. <laughs> He didn't even get his, like, head tentacles out until, like, the last possible oh, second. Man, I wish I could, um... So check this out. Yeah. I'm trying to figure out... Very nice. Yeah. I'm trying to figure out if that means, like, you're just amazing this time, or just, like, an indication of how badly you fucking sucked <laughs> last time. Oh. Let's just, uh... The balls, you suck. Let's just go to the, 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 the first one. <laughs> That's um, a Dr. Seuss poem that never really point. made it out there. <laughs> oh, the balls, you'll suck. <laughs> True that, yo. True that. I heard that one before in the Dr. Seuss Wikipedia article. It was written by Dr. Seuss himself. He said, my name is Seuss. <laughs> he never the said, end. He never said that. This guy's dead! <laughs> fucking- whoa, 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 easy. Yeah. That was like an EDM concert. He's- <laughs> <laughs> Just an EDM concert just pops out of his head. <laughs> And he does some weird fucking like, oh, I don't know if I like that effect. <laughs> and then he does it for like 10 minutes straight and everyone's like, woo! Yeah, yeah. I need to get some motherfucking this and that. Oh, and the other thing. Yeah, I'm gonna get that. Cause that's a good thing to get, right? I don't know Do you what so? you're getting or what you're talking about. Do you about. think so? Sure. I think so. I've never played this game, Aaron. You, yeah, but you've seen it enough to get it. You'd be surprised. And how truly checked out I've been for the last uh, 30 to 35 oh episodes. God, such a jerk. <laughs> I wish sometimes that you would just stop being you and start being someone else that I actually <laughs> like. <laughs> Could you possibly be less you? Yeah, that would. Is be that super? Is that too much to ask? Super Ooh, great of you. I really appreciate. I'm gonna it. stealth some of these. I'm gonna. Mm, I'm gonna. Ugh. Ugh. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna. Ooh. Yeah, do you really need those? I'm pearl gonna stealth slugs? some of these. I'm gonna- why do I keep saying stell? I'm gonna stell some of these. Yeah. 20 to be exact. And then I'm gonna buy some other fucking blood vials. I'm gonna stell some of these, like you just borrow teas I just from, sold my blood vials. Later in the sense. <laughs> oh God. God damn it! Right. Oh, I'm so stupid! <laughs> Jeez. I bought them and sold them and now I have less. <laughs> <laughs> God, I wish- I wish sometimes I would stop being so dumb! <laughs> it really bothers me! It's- it's stunning, actually. I'm just gonna do the old-fashioned trick and get some in one fucking go, alright? Okay, right? okay. So, what did you do today, Dan? No, how many did you have that you lost? I had ten, and I would've <laughs> been able six. to buy an extra, like, four, and now I have six. <laughs> So, so together, of, yeah. it could have been 20 oh, if boy. both existences were real, but this isn't a Star Trek episode, Dan. Right. But where's the mouth? Where's the mouth? With the mouth? <laughs> With the mouth. <laughs> I'm sorry. Did um, 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 <laughs> did Dane Cook? Shit, shit. Oh, oh fuck. God, man. I told you, it kills you in one hit's bullshit. That's brutal. That's what you want to watch out for. Yeah, I see that That's now. That's the one spot. I know it'll make you feel better. What? Let's eat that gummy bear. It's only five pounds.
right. Yeah. Make the peepees, make the poopoos. 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 Hi, welcome to the end of this episode. Yes. Uh, someone who gave it us this. This to us. Someone gave us a giant five pound gummy bear, and we uh. We, we're gonna eat it. It really is. It's like it's like it's, it's like, the most solid thing I've ever. It's, wait, j just like drop. Oh, that's gummy. That's gummy goodness. So Jeez, um, that's gonna turn out great on the microphone. Yeah, I'm sure it will. Can you hand me the scissors? Oh yes. So I can free this from its bonds. Oh sure. Okay. We're gonna eat this because it it reminds us so much of the Ebrietas. the boss that we just fought, Ebrietas, the daughter Ebrietas. of the cosmos. This is uh... who is a jelly monstrosity, <laughs> much like this. They also make gummy alligators. I don't know why I'm plugging this. <laughs> I don't know who the yeah, hell this they are is. murdering people by, and probably bears. I, well, it's like how old uh, is this too? Because I don't. Uh, uh, all right. Oh, no. Okay. okay. I'm noticing Ma Mark uh, Markiplier ate one of these too, and Did he, he? he was saying that like. Did he? Yeah, he said. A big problem with it was that they were not perfectly airtight sealed, so like Ooh. it was pretty like grimy inside. Ew. And I'm noticing some kind of like <laughs> like give that yeah. it uh, uh, you don't uh, want give to be the word that describes your food. Whoa, it has a lot of give. Smell that. Ooh, that smells like Nyquil straight <laughs> it up. It does. It's like a hundred percent. Okay. All right. So, um, wow. We should probably get a close-up on this, too, okay. huh? Oh, God! Oh, no! Oh. I have to cradle it like a child! Why would you do such a thing? It needs two plates. Um, okay. Alright, so I'm gonna cut it in half. Do you want... Do you want the head or the body? I want the... I don't care. Uh, uh, oh, I can't even make any headway with this knife. Can't make any headway? <laughs> Dude, it's impossible. <laughs> We're gonna have to... We're gonna have to cut this, like, actually cut the footage. <laughs> Cause I can't. Oh, I, this feels so Game of Thronesy. Uh, this is more nightmarish than Bloodborne. <laughs> oh God, it's it's, well, it's it's like red and shimmery too. So it's it's so like. Uh, oh God! Oh God! Oh God! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can't break it apart. Ugh. I'm not strong enough. Jeez, man. Ebrietas! <laughs> oh my god. Oh my. <laughs> die, die, you sick son of a bitch. Ugh. Oh, God. Ah! Jesus. You want some help? Nope, got it. Oh, nice. nice. That was one of the worst experiences of my life. Okay, um, well, dig in. <laughs> Dan has so nicely. Oh, gross. <laughs> it's Jesus. Ugh. It's so much worse than you think it'll be. Dan has been so nice as to cut me a slice. <laughs> That's an intentional rhyme. <laughs> and now I will partake Go in, this, for it. in this Ebrietas inspired treat. Daughter of the cosmos. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, that has to be disgusting. You know how it smells like NyQuil? Yeah. Does it taste that way too? Yeah. A little bit. Yeah, a little bit. It a little is, bit. It is pure chemicals. There is nothing. Mm. <laughs> it's like... It's, it's good, but there's so... Like this... This is like how much you would normally eat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And this is how much I actually oh, ate. Oh, God. Well... This calls for a second giant gross bite, I think. Nah, this is... <laughs> <laughs> oh, mm. barf. It, oh. It's too much, man. <laughs> yeah, is it? <laughs> oh. Let everyone see that. <laughs> Can I some more? Can I have some more? Give me some more. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Dan, why don't you try to take a bite? I'd love to. Wow, that looks really nice. What do you think? It's good. Yeah? Even that's too much. <laughs> Just like this tiny I had like one sixty-fourth of the ear. <laughs> What is the net weight of this? Oh, it's got my yeah, mouth all I over know. It. <laughs> it's, it's like a perfect dental impression. You can make braces off that. Oh yeah, you could probably identify a murder from mm -hmm. this. It was a murder. The murder of our digestive systems. Well, I'm done. Yeah. Uh, check please. This has been fine. Ebriatas, you were delicious. See you on the next Bloodborne. Now I'm grossed out and horny. <laughs> I can smell it. Oh, oh, so vile. Uh, it looks like jello. Oh, it, it just looks like jello. It tastes, that's what it tastes like. It tastes like red jello. Yeah, but like. It's like they put too much jello mix in here. Yes, and not enough water. And it's super. Goodbye, everybody. Oh, jeez. Oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. It feels good in your mouth when you, it feels good, but you don't want to swallow it because this is like 20,000 calories right here. Oh, I wanted to bring it up while we were, uh, while you were doing a little grinding off camera. Um, we briefly discussed, uh, the hilariousness of, uh, Dumb and Dumber 2, or lack thereof. Oh, yeah. And how I watched it on the plane back from Japan, and, um, the problem is, not, not a really great movie, but, like, there, there are certain moments that made me laugh a lot, and, like, we were just talking about the weirdness of, like, laughing on a plane, because... Oh, yeah. Yeah, because, like... Chances are someone is like either reading or sleeping or like <laughs> watching a sad movie next to you <laughs> and you're just like totally silent and then all of a sudden you're like <laughs> 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 And you're just like uh, mm, uh, mm, and then just the <laughs> 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 the worst. I also, I get, I get, sometimes I get a silent laugh, like a... <laughs> which just makes you sound like a serial killer if you're sitting next to someone and you start doing it. Oh, fuck, Dan. Are you excited? What happened? Okay, I just summoned somebody. Welcome no way. back, by the way. Yay. I summoned a friend to fight with me. No it's way. It's Batman 13579 <laughs> 8 Thank you, cooperator. He's the cooperator. Come with me, and we will fight together, Batman. Get the fuck Hello. This can happen? Hello. I, I need to do a... I need to do a thing with him. I need to- God damn it, we'll just go. <laughs> <laughs> I was trying to do a pose and it wasn't working. Th he's an actual person? He's gonna fight with me. That's awesome. Yeah, he is awesome. Hold Let's on, go, I you cone-headed monkey bastard. On, I gotta- I gotta get my shit out. Oh, <laughs> you fuck. just let him fight. Hold on, well, yeah, I mean, fuck, don't just run in there. I gotta equip <laughs> my fucking shit first. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Oh, uh, we're fucked. I'm <laughs> <laughs> oh, just going in there, fucking balls a blazing. <laughs> Hold on, I gotta get my shit back. <laughs> I'm coming, Batman! <laughs> <laughs> wow, he's really kicking its ass right now. Oh, oh god. Wait, he's okay. going yeah, down. you're oh, fucked! Okay. We're okay. working together! You and me! Oh god. Oh jeez, actually. Oh, Batman. He's almost dead. <laughs> Get your oh, shit no. together, Batman. I wonder what happened to the first 13,592,000 Batman. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna do it! We're gonna do it! We're gonna beat Ebrietas together! Okay. It's gonna be great. We're gonna have so much fun. Uh -huh. Oh. Wow, and it doesn't like affect like how many echoes you get or anything. No, like man, he's just a helper, bro. That's awesome. Yeah, he's why cool. that? Why in God's name have we not been doing this? For because a it's, I don't know. It's like a it's like a pride thing. Oh, okay, <laughs> fair enough. Boy, she looks really gross. Ah! Oh, jeez, she looks like E.B. Squid sushi when she like rears up, oh. like her underlegs. Oh yeah. Ugh. Um, it's pronounced Ebby. Is it really? Yeah, bro. Wow, I learned something. Oh, like Ebritas. <laughs> oh my God. Ebritas. You're so right. Yeah. 
Gross shrimp, daughter of the cosmos. It all makes sense oh, now. Oh, hold on. Yeah, she's doing be, her thing. Be careful. She's doing her Jimmy Jams. Oh no, she's just doing yeah. that thing, whatever the fuck that is. Yeah. Watch out for oh, 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 here it goes, here it comes, here it comes. it! Okay, she did it. Oh, Woo! Uh, we're all good Will now. Will she only do that once? Yeah, she'll do it again if I, if I let her. Right. But she's close. She's getting close. Mm -hmm. She's getting close to the death times. Yeah. And she's stronger now, so that's yeah, fun, too. So that's good. Woo! Oh, no. Oh, chill out. With Look out, Batman! <laughs> Batman, watch your back! <laughs> watch your back, man! I'm the squid killer this Japanese restaurant deserves. <laughs> Woo -hoo -hoo. I gotta heal. I gotta heal. No, heal, heal, oh, heal, heal, oh. heal, oh. heal, heal. Everything's cool. Everything's fine. We're all fine. We're all friends. Whoa, We're all friends. Run, Fuck, run, she's run. doing it. She's run. doing it. Ah! Oh, she's doing it to Batman. Oh, no. oh, she's doing it to my friend Batman. Oh, we're fine. Okay, oh we're good. God, Batman, you saved my fucking life. Good fucking dodging, Batman. Oh, Batman's the Boy, best. Boy, that really helps. Oh my God, we're yeah, almost there. Yeah. We're almost yeah. there. Oh, oh. Bring it home, baby. Oh, hold on. Woo. Run out of stamina. Yeah. yeah. Batman. Batman, you. Are my savior. You're my savior, Batman. You're my savior. Hold on, let me pose for you. Let me pose for you. Fucking just, just, no, I don't just, just, just pose. Fucking pick Thank it. Thank you. Yes, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! Thank you, Batman. Oh, that's wonderful. Oh, he and I are friends now. They call him the cooperator. <laughs> and the game grumps! Fucking cool I am. I'm really fucking cool. Is there a way to get life back? Uh, oh, there's yeah. the door. Delete right? your World of Warcraft account. Oh shit! <laughs> All right. <laughs> so topical. Uh, it's, it's like topical for like ten years ago. Yeah. Ah <laughs> uh, shit. To take it. I meant God. for Guild Grumps, dummy. Oh, for Guild Grumps, duh. <laughs> Hot Tux, duh. Go check out Guild Grumps. Haha, <laughs> it's a pro show we made. It's great. We did make that. Yeah. I felt bad. I had to bail on episode three. It's okay, you were doing things that were way more important. Oh, shit! <laughs> <laughs> I was so- f It's funny, watch it- Cause we filmed those oh, a long time ago. We. Oh my god. We filmed those a long time ago and, um, I forgot how, like, horribly burnt out I was in general oh, at that yeah. time. Like, those Starbomb albums, writing them at, like, that pace was killing me. Yeah. Well, let's not do that again. Yeah. I mean, let's make a third album for yeah, sure. Yeah, no, but. definitely. But, not do it uh, 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 like for with a, uh, with a month. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. If only we didn't care about the product. <laughs> yeah. Could you right. imagine how relaxing that would be if uh, we didn't give a dude. shit if it was good or not? Didn't give a good goddamn man. We can churn out fucking shit. Be like a fucking dream. And then our reputations would go down the fucking tubes. Yeah. And well, they'd be like, what happened? Just... The YouTube's yeah. that is. <laughs> I'll okay. tell you what happened. Ugh. And then we could do a YouTubers react to Game Grumps selling out. <laughs> Us. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The game, our reaction to Game Grumps selling out. Yeah. We're just a pile of money. Like, awesome. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Who cares? <laughs> <laughs> I sure don't. <laughs> that is fucking funny. Uh. Oh man, we won't sell out. We Too bad that'll never happen. We'll never be rich. Yeah. Well. The problem is we care about like, even when like we do brand deals and stuff, we care about like what it is. Oh, you hell know, yeah. like if we didn't give a shit, like, God, that would be so awesome. I've learned my lesson. That fucking pit in my stomach of like, wow, this really sucks. Yeah. Why and did I'm I telling say yes people to it's this? good? <laughs> yeah. Ugh. Yeah, I can't. I can't fucking do that. So now it's it's just only say yes to good stuff, and only say yes if they agree to the stupid shit that you're gonna make out of it. Yeah, exactly. Like, they have to be, like, we have to have that conversation with any, like, advertisers that, like, you know we're idiots, right? Yeah. You know we're, like, the most sarcastic pricks in the world, If right? you let us write this, it's gonna be fucking stupid. I can tell by his briefly angry eyebrows that yeah. he's someone we should be stabbing. You, well, you stab, I just roll. Yeah. Actually, that's not a statement I should ever take out of context. <laughs> Didn't like his face! Stabbed him. <laughs> <laughs> I knew by the way he looked at me. Yeah. He was ripe for the stabbing. Man, I love stabbing. Whew. Don't even passes. get me started. How delightful this stabbing is. Don't even, don't even get me started on talking about stabbing and yeah. the stabbing action itself. L is for elephantitis. Don't, don't even get me started. 
<laughs> oh man. Jesus, Brent Weinbach, you're a fucking genius. This is one of the funniest things I've ever seen. Ever. It really is. Especially when you start playing it for someone with absolutely no context or warning. That's exactly what I did with Barry. Yeah, did you like it? Yeah. Okay, killer. Laughed at all the same spots. Yeah, yeah. Like, oh, that's a good sign. <laughs> It's so fucking Such funny. An elephantitis, don't even get me started. <laughs> made me laugh so hard. S is for psycho. Ouch. <laughs> Why is that funny? I don't know. I don't know. It uh, just is. Uh, yes. Yes, tree. Oh, oh come don't on, man. Don't cry a, like a yogurt almond tear. Jesus. Why would they do that to us? Yeah, and just dance victoriously in front of his crying face. Oh. Yeah, you gonna cry? <laughs> We're happy! We're happy from your pain! God, 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 God. Ah. Oh, okay. That blast. Now y'all did. Yeah. Now dads. You mess with the bull, you get the horns, bitch. You mess with the bull, you get the Breakfast Club reference. <laughs> <laughs> That's true, actually. Yeah. My favorite, my favorite character is John Bender because he's smart, but he also is a criminal. <laughs> And that's sort of how I feel inside, you know, like... I can kind of identify with that. I'm misunderstood, but I'm also very Don't wise for my age. Don't fuck this up. Don't fuck this up. You nice. did it. You fucked it up. <laughs> Isn't it weird how John Bender was the voice of reason and he was the criminal? Who, uh, who played him? Judd Nelson? Yes. I guess that is weird. I think that's the whole point, though. Yeah. Look it at us. We're a fucking rebel, an artist, a lover, ranger, <laughs> wizard, and acrobat. Acrobat! <laughs> Thief! <laughs> and then he's like, what? And they're like, get him! <laughs> <laughs> oh, goodness. That really made me laugh. Deploy the Kirby tank. Maybe I fucking will. <laughs> Don't tell me what to do. Yeah, you can't tell me what to do, you cheesy clay bastard. But that sounds fun. But yeah, I will. I mean, I will, but because I wanted to. <laughs> Not because you said it. You idiot. Shithead. Stupid. This is like way better than anything else I've ever played. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's super enjoyable. I hope people are liking Die. watching it. Die! Die! Because God, it is relaxing as fuck to it, play. It's a really weird experience, uh... Cause I have to look at the gamepad the whole time. Right. I'm not used to not looking at I don't at feel this. as connected to you as we usually do. We usually are when we play games together. Cause usually, you have my ha my hand on your lap. <laughs> yeah, you, usually you have- Usually your... I'm gently stroking various points of pressure. You can keep doing that Looking if you, for like, sweet just, release. There's nothing- there's nothing different about this one, just-, nah, just I'll be looking up. at the pad. Ah shit, I fucking summoned Gordo. The deep pad. Didn't mean to. The D-pad? <laughs> Why have I never thought of that? <laughs> Why hasn't anyone? The fucking D-pad! Yeah. Seems almost too logical. Ooh, found that treasure. Nice, thank you for getting that treasure. Not a probs. Little... Pizza? Oh my god, pizza! P-I-Z-Z-A. I I want pizza. Oh, did I happen <laughs> to say? Whipped cream pouring <laughs> like waterfalls. I was just about to fucking say it. <laughs> Whipped cream pours like waterfalls. Oh my god, are you seeing Kirby when he charges up? I know, it's friggin' adorable. <laughs> Words cannot express. It like actually is kind of scary. Oh, it's terrifying. Like he gets like, whoa, that's a little bit too serious. Yep. Like it's legit disturbing. That is not cartoon tank anymore, that is like yeah. real tank. Yeah, so whoa, 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 easy. Holy crap. Easy army of the damned. Oh, Whoa, why are you like why are you like heavenly right now? Uh you see that? Yeah, because I showered and quaffed my hair a little more than usual. So <laughs> oh, thank you, you for are, noticing. You are divine right yeah. now. <laughs> why are you heavenly right now? <laughs> um can't believe it took you two years to notice. <laughs> Man, there's just something about you, I've gotta say. It's fine. There's something between us anyway. Dude, I don't know. First of all, nice Def Punk reference. Yeah, no problem. Secondly, I don't know when this is gonna air, but it's probably pretty close to, like, the two-year anniversary of me joining the show. What is it, like, July? July 25th? I, I, I think, think it was the end of June. Wow. Two 
two years. Isn't that crazy? Too bad we didn't save the punch out finale for that. I know. Well, we fucked it up. Yeah. But that should we can just re-air it. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> the ultimate like laziness. That's amazing. I haven't cut my hair once since I joined the yeah. show. Dude, it's weird when I look back on like old videos of you and you have short hair, I'm like, whoa, I forgot about this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Jesus. Well, I'll have it again once it's time to uh, donate it to the chillins. How much longer do you think? It's got to go another like five or six inches, I believe. Oh my god. Yeah, so it's going to get real fucking stupid. <laughs> You get real deaf leopardy up in here. You know what's weird is I used to, all the I used to get the hair questions, but mm -hmm. now it's just you that gets the hair questions. What do you mean? Well, whenever we're like, would you want to ask the game grumps a question or something? It's like, I I used to always get like, you know, what shampoo do you blah, 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 and how do you take care of your hair? Yeah. But now it's it's just you. I don't yeah. get any of the hair questions and anymore. And the answer is no shampoo, and I don't. <laughs> And for me, it's- I take extremely good care of my hair. Yeah. Well, that's the thing, man. I'm- I'm all dewy, so, like, my hair is crazy dry by- by- uh, by nature. So, like, it's better not to wash it. Yeah. So, otherwise it bizarre, gets dude. all, like, It It was, like, face first in the goo. <laughs> it took me, like, ten years to figure out the right, like, balance for my hair. Oh, I know. It's- and you need to find it out for your skin, too, like, what types of things you can eat and everything. Yeah. Which is why, like, you look like such a fucking disaster. When, um, when you're a teenager. I did it. It's- it's Garfield. Like, that's Garfield, is oh. it not? <laughs> he must be smiling because it's not a Monday. <laughs> <laughs> that would be awesome if this episode aired on a Monday. Oh, boy. <laughs> It's not a Monday. Oh my Someone days. found lasagna in the ancient temple. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like Odie took the day off. <laughs> Wait, Garfield is ridiculous. And I died again. I Garfield is the funniest thing on the planet. And is not it? and ironically, completely ironically. I don't think I've ever found a single actual Garfield comic funny. Oh really? Yeah. I thought well. I don't know. I, I used to think Garfield was funny, but it might just be because I compared it to Heathcliff, which was literally the most unfunny thing in the world. I don't remember anything from Heathcliff except that he looks dumb. Yeah. He's just an ugly character. In a doofy show. A doofy show. He did have a friend I liked called Wordsworth, who was like a cat poet, and he had funky hair. Oh shit. Do you remember him? He was like white, I think? Sounds kind of familiar. Yeah. I think you talk like this. <laughs> oh. 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 Hey, hey, hey. Hey, welcome back to hey, Game hey, Grumps. Hey, hey, hey. It's like hey with a period. Aaron was just and then telling hey me. With another period. Yeah. Go ahead. No, you were just telling me more about your fucking Apple Watch that <laughs> fucking you can't stop talking about. <laughs> <laughs> you just keep yawning and like outstretching that arm. Like, oh, gosh. What time is it? It's funny because I'm, I'm like. Like, 90% of it is me doing it facetiously. Oh, of course. Of course. And then there's, like, the other 10% where I that actually totally am real. excited about it's it. It's totally real. I- you are- you and Mark. Mark, who also got one. Um, Mr. Applier. Like, shocking how into it you guys are. Oh, yeah. Especially when you get into the same room with each other. <laughs> and you're like... And, Ooh, we can send each other our heartbeats! Yeah, we, <laughs> <laughs> yes, it will track your heartbeat and then send it to another person. It, I don't know the functionality of this. I don't know. There's no point to it. It's, it's to show love. One of the most useless things. Even in a situation where it's like, I'll, I'll, okay, I'll send it to my wife. Yeah. It's like, what the fuck does she give a shit about? It's, I mean, it's primarily... It just goes I, boop, 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 <laughs> and that's it. Yeah, like a heart. Like, I, I, I think, um... I think almost all of the functions between two Apple Watches like, the main functionality is to just make everyone who does not have an Apple Watch in the room feel excluded and <laughs> feel the need to purchase an Apple Watch. I think that, you know what, I think you're right. Yeah. I think that was actually the design philosophy behind Very, yeah. Apple Watch to Apple Watch functionality. There's there's no question in my mind. Because, uh, boy, I've, I've never seen anything turn people into such immediate douchebags <laughs> as, as the Apple Watch. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I've, I've gotten to the point too where it's like, I'm I'm totally trying to avoid all the like douche tropes. Right. And I I had this moment where I was like at this, uh, I was at a store and the clerk was like, "Hey, nice watch." And I was and I was just like, 
Thanks, it's mine and mine alone. <laughs> no, it's just like, <laughs> thanks. And then, like, that's it? Right, right, because right. Because I was trying to assess the situation of whether or not they were, like, actually, like, they knew what it was and they were, like, wanted to know more. Oh, or, yeah, sure. But I was just like, nope, nope, you know what? I'm just gonna let this ride. I'm just not gonna Thanks, even... it's the hottest new thing in technology. <laughs> I'm glad you noticed. Ugh. <laughs> uh. That was... I mean, really, it's more of a status symbol than anything. Yeah, honestly. I, I, I God, got, you must feel inferior. I almost got the gold one. I almost got the gold one. <laughs> yeah. Did you know that they'll switch out the innards for you? Because <laughs> it's it's so awesome that it's gold, that if, if there's a new Apple Watch, you can just send it in, and they'll... They'll totally like, I mean, <laughs> yeah. I, don't, I don't mean to brag or anything, but I, I almost got it. I almost got it. <laughs> yeah. I just... I decided, like, I only want... Too much money today, <laughs> as opposed to obscene amounts of money. <laughs> oh boy, it's pretty wonderful. It's it's not it's not worth it. I it, just want to say not, right now, it's the, the not Apple Watch worth is it. not worth it. No, you talk about it more than any other thing. Well, that's because I have it now. W right, and it, it's worth it. <laughs> it's not worth it. Wait, it's why, so wh expensive. Oh oh, it's like the it's it's absurdly expensive it, for, for what it is. Which is essentially an extension of functionality you already have. Uh, it, as in, like, an iPhone on your wrist? Yes. You could- oh, fuck. You could- you could tape your- your phone to your wrist and it would have the same functionality as <laughs> the fucking Apple Watch. <laughs> do, do you so, remember the what, fucking- What is happening to me? I do uh, not know, Aaron. What are you doing up there? I, I you know. just killed us both. I-, I did- Wallmaster <laughs> came out of nowhere and started fondling my little curveballs. <laughs> Do you remember the Flight of the Concords? Did you ever watch that show? No. Oh, it's one of my all-time favorites. I've seen, like, clips. It's wonderful. There's this part where, like, there's two guys, Jermaine and Brett, and, uh, Brett wants to give him, like, Jermaine a, uh, uh I got, I saved oh. you. I'll, I'll just keep an eye on Wallmaster and spear him every time he gets close. Cool. Um, Brett gets Jermaine a gift, and, uh, the gift he gets him is, uh, a camera phone, uh -huh. but... He just like takes Jermaine's cell phone with duct tape and tapes it to his camera, <laughs> <laughs> and and he's like, uh, he's like, did you like the camera phone I gave you? And like they have these New Zealand accents. Uh -huh. like, no, actually, I think you ruined my phone when you gave me that, and my camera. <laughs> it's so fucking, they're so dry in their delivery, but it's so wonderful. Oh man, yeah, they we'll are, we'll watch very those. Funny. The, the, oh, thanks. You got it. They were enormous inspirations for NSP, and uh, yeah, you told me that once. Yeah, and I was I was kind of surprised. I was like, oh, I've never, because you, they're usually, a different vibe. Yeah, well, for sure. well, not only that, but like usually when something's a huge inspiration, it's like you, I feel like you talk about it enough for people to sort of get that, right? You know, right? Where it's like, what was an inspiration for you to do games or whatever? And I'm like, Mega Man. Oh, you know, sure, It's sure. like, oh, of course, Mega Man. Well, I think a lot of it was just that Flight of the Concords only went for two seasons, because, like, after two seasons, um, the guys in the band decided that, like, the quality of their music was going down, because it was so demanding to... They didn't want to continue the show unless it was going to be super awesome, you oh. know? Which is really cool, because I'm sure they left a ton of fucking money on the table to make that decision. Um, but they had, like, integrity about it, and... Um, so, that's really cool. Yeah, so they haven't really put out a new show in almost eight or nine years. So I think that's part of it. Like, mm. like their heyday was a little little while ago. But I mean, I listen to them constantly, and like I never stop loving them. I never stop loving them. <laughs> <laughs> um, but like the other inspirations for us, like Lonely Island and Tenacious D, are a little bit more active still, and so much more. Um, Whoa, whoa, whoa! So much more wild and like in their delivery and intense and more goofy, like like we actually are. Mm -hmm. Um, so oh man, we'll have to go around, I guess. No, we got this. Ah, fuck. <laughs> fuck it, I'm going around. Um, so I, th I think that's part of the reason I just don't talk about them a lot. Oh, okay. Yeah. You know what's uh, you know what sort of works out in our favor. My musical comedy inspiration mm -hmm. is NSP. Is that right? Yeah. Dude, that's incredibly flattering. Yeah, of course. Wow. I... Why wouldn't you be? You guys fucking kick ass. You know... You, you guys are the best comedy music... Dude! I know. Stop! I like you way better than Lonely Island. Oh. <laughs> well, that's, that's incredibly flattering, although I... 
I would never- Lonely Island is one- uh, I mean, I'm not saying they're bad, I love no, Lonely Island. they're incredible. I, I like you guys more. They're one group that I would never want to, like, be compared against, because, like, they have- They have- They're incredibly talented, and they also have so much at their disposal. It's, like, a real uphill battle to, like, put our stuff up against theirs, because, like, they just- They can make it look so much more professional. Oh, yeah. You know, because of, uh- because of the resources they have. That S that sweet SNL cash. Yeah. That being said though, they like it takes incredible talent on their part to make the most of it. Yeah, absolutely. Which is which is no, dude, what's really inspiring. A zillion fucking gallons of respect for them. Yeah. All I'm saying is that you guys inspire me more. Oh gosh. Well, you are without a doubt my favorite uh, friend named Aaron next to Aaron Umatani, uh, and, uh, and a couple other Aarons I can't think of at the moment. <laughs> You're like number four on yeah. my, my... All my friends named Aaron that are listening to this are like, and... <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh, God. Well, that's very flattering. Thank you. Okay, I died. <laughs> We, we make a good team. Yeah, yeah. You and I. Yeah, it's 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 gone pretty well, I have to say. Because I was just on the Nintendo World Championships. Yes, you then, did pretty well. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Um, Way better than I thought you were going. I to. thought I was going to lose immediately. Yes, so. me too. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no one is more intimately familiar with your video game skills than I am, man. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for the vote of confidence. Uh, it's retroactive. My fourth favorite Dan. <laughs> In this room. <laughs> Next to Dan the controller, yeah. which I've named just now. <laughs> just now. Uh, you really said it all, didn't you? Well, I guess this episode can end now that all of the thoughts in our heads have been gone and expelled. Yeah. Dogs, am I right? <laughs> Cats. Better or what worse. What about them? You decide. You know, I never liked cats growing up, but now I think they're pretty cool. I only like my cats, and that yes. might be a, a shitty thing to say, but no, I mean like they're the only cats I've had good experiences with. Well, yeah, you sort of have to they you sort of have to spend a, a, an amount of time with cats before like they open up to you. Yeah. And it's, it's cooler. I will say, just like rationally, mm -hmm. it's better to have cats if you like to travel. Yeah. Oh, for because sure. Dogs will get so fucking upset if yeah. you leave. They have crazy abandonment issues, dude. If I if if we didn't travel as much, I'd have a dog in a heartbeat right yeah. now. Like my god, ha like I've needed a, like the the cuddles of a, a living creature this month so goddamn badly. <laughs> like there have been so many times where I've thought like, oh, if I had a fucking dog. But uh, I guess I just have to fucking watch. Uh, the episode of our, our Teletubbies playthrough where <laughs> those little girls fucking run with that dog through the park and make him drink gasoline. <laughs> That's the closest I can get. I made I'll him drink gasoline. <laughs> I I'll make him go faster. <laughs> oh god. That's one of my, like, it's one of my all-time favorites. All-time faves. Yeah. For yeah. sure. That, uh, that was a really good one. Ooh. Did we ever find out if, like, the Teletubbies comment that was on that was an actual, like, was official Teletubbies? Yeah, it was people? absolutely official Teletubbies. Like, did they watch the episode, do you think? <laughs> or did they just, like, see that we played it and said thank you? Uh, you know, I don't know. I some I sometimes wonder about, like, stuff like that. Like, we talked a lot of shit on the Teletubbies <laughs> for them to be like, thanks for playing. <laughs> Maybe they're just trying to play, you know, do the good guy approach, like, you we know We called them soulless monsters. <laughs> In no uncertain terms. <laughs> Look, man, you know, some people, they, they just, kindness is key, that's what they say. You catch more flies with honey. What are you talking and about? we are the flies. Yeah, what are they trying to catch? I don't know, maybe they're just trying to get those, yeah. that sweet Game Grumps bump. Uh, let's let these guys who hate us know. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Well, hate's a strong word. Say more terrified by. Yeah. Oh, you gotta, they gotta get that sweet bump, you know what I'm saying? The grump bump. The, the grump bizzle? Yeah. The grizzle bizzle? <laughs> it's fucking, you know, it's like, the completionist comes on our show, fucking, we plug the completionist and he gets more views. Happy to do it. That makes me feel good. But if Gerard's fucking, a wonderful guy. If, if As is Jared, his other half. Tell, <laughs> Teletubby sees that and they're like, you know what, maybe we should get a little grump bump. And, they, yeah. and they're like, thanks for playing the game. When inside, really, they're like, I, I wish I the, these guys like, died. They, they were all dead. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All, all of, even the ones that weren't in this episode, I wish they were all dead. We're sending Poe and Lala right after you. <laughs>
<laughs> there are secret assassins. Oh god. It's our team of creepy oh, assassins. Oh god, could you fucking imagine waking up? At like, and one of those things is just fucking, like, its face is just, like, right over you, with a knife. And you're just like, well, this is the last thing I'm seeing. Yeah. What an unfortunate end. Your last words are, Tinky Winky. Did you ever, like, I don't know if I ever told you this, like, I had, I had a ton of dinosaur books growing up. And there was one dinosaur book about, like, um, I think some sort of raptor, actually. Or, uh -huh. or a Dinonychius. I don't know how you pronounce it. But the ones with, like, the giant claws, uh -huh. like, on their toes. Yeah. Uh -huh. And, uh... I think, the, I think the dinosaur's name was Rhoda. R-H-O-D-A. If anyone fucking knows what I'm talking about. <laughs> this is going back to the fucking 80s. Rhoda, Rhoda the Dionychius, yeah, right. Look that up like, on Google. Yeah, by all means. Uh, so, I don't even like, know what letter to start with? It just go, <laughs> it just goes <laughs> through her life cycle, uh -huh. and it like, you know, it's very sciency and scientific. But like, you know, it's it's a, it's like a story arc, so you sort of get attached to the 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 creature, and uh, and like the last page out of nowhere, like she decides to attack like one of these dinosaurs that has spiky things on the side of him. And he turns upwards at the last second and like spears her and then like the last line like this is like out of nowhere There's like no indication. This is coming. It's like Rhoda's life had come to a sudden and violent end and that's the end of the book Oh my god, and I was like what the fuck like that was a hell of a lesson for like a first grader to learn. <laughs> <laughs> I love dinosaurs. It was crazy. Yeah, seriously it was really nuts I guess it's I guess it's best to teach children about Sudden and inevitable death when uh, it's like the least um, close to anything you've ever known in reality. Yeah, that makes sense. It's like a fucking dinosaur. That does make sense. You know what's difficult about playing this game? What's that? Is that I'm not looking at this script. Like we have, we figured out the perfect configuration to where where to put our microphones right. so that they're not distracting while we're playing a game. Yes. This is a whole new beast because I'm looking down at my lap. Right. While I'm playing. And the fucking microphone is just like right, it's like right fucking there. And I don't know, like I, I can't hold it up to where the screen is and play, because that would be ridiculous. Yeah. So. yeah. I guess this is more of a visual thing, but just try to imagine Aaron weirdly like twisting his neck in a funny way for uh, just hours. Hours and hours. Yeah, but do that in the context of me looking at a Wii U gamepad and yeah. not and under any other context. Either way, I'm digging it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Not trying to suck your own dick. No. I cannot express that enough. No. You just gave away the joke. I'm sorry. So you explain the joke. If you explain the joke, it's like dissecting a frog. This is this it's, is what he's I got, told you. He's got gross guts inside. Okay. And that, he and he and he won't rib it no more. That's yeah. That's <laughs> that's you know what they say at the you know at the UCB. I'm almost. They say I'm almost considering starting this episode. Over. The key, the key to comedy is making sure it gets a good ribbit. It's not what they say. And where are the game grumps? <laughs> hey guys, welcome back hey, to Game Grumps. Back. We're welcome playing back. Kirby's Rainbow Fresh Curse. Start. No one knows that we were not funny for, <laughs> for two minutes. <laughs> There's no evidence whatsoever that we are not funny. Nope. I wonder what like. I mean, I'm sure it's a totally subjective thing. But I wonder if we could personally watch through our entire catalog of videos, which has to be in the thousands by now. Oh yeah. Like, I wonder if we could decide what was our most not funny episode. Um... Oh man, I feel like I had one. Like I knew it. Really? Yeah. That guy kind of looks mm. like Rick. From Rick and Morty. What? The guy in the back? No, no. The well, the spiky headed thing. I'll show they, that? Him, him. <laughs> if you look to the side. Like a, their eyes and a mouth. Morty, what are you doing, Morty? Oh, you killed the Simpsons, Morty. What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> oh no, oh look at the baby one. <laughs> I was standing. Uh, oh, I'm, I'm, I'm underwater, Morty. Oh, I'm, I'm underwater. I can't breathe. <laughs> oh, it's, oh, it's too much for me to handle. Oh, jeez. All oh, these bubbles coming out. That uh, just implies that I can't breathe anymore. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Yeah, what? What could it have been? 
It's a- it's a fucking octopus tentacle. No, no, I mean like our- our least funny episode. Oh, oh. Cause I mean there are episodes where we've been serious, you know, but like that was the purpose of that episode. No, I, yeah. I, I'm talking An like shit where, where it was like- just like, no fuck. There's like, just no redeeming Burned out, whatsoever. just fucking, yeah. yeah. Well, cause the ones where we're burned out end up being some of the better ones. Usually. Oh yeah, like Yoshi's Cookie. Oh god, and the fucking pass the mustard Batman from Pokemon. <laughs> I still fucking think about that. Pass the mustard Batman. <laughs> Can't Batman. make a move, but he needs that mustard. <laughs> <laughs> he really needs that mustard. <laughs> if you're gonna make something that's like really enduring, you know, like I hope people are still listening to Ninja Sex Party in like 20 years. Yeah. And maybe that's wildly optimistic, but I'd like those. I'd like those jokes to still be funny then, you know? Which sure. is why we've never done anything, like, topical, you well, know? We're always gonna pee and poo, Dan. Like, what the fuck are you talking about? I stand wildly corrected. That's absolutely true. Like, that's the one thing that you can absolutely count Take on. Take to the bank. Yeah. Is that we're definitely going to still be peeing and pooping in 20 years. S fuck! Stop fucking dying, Aaron. I was like, I was just about to say it too, because I could. I was like, he's fucking toddling awfully close Ooh. to the bottom of the screen. I was trying. I was trying to preserve my rainbow because I was running out. I'm gonna scissor kick your Johnson, <laughs> specifically the Johnson region. But I'm saying, like, you know, it's like, all right, fucking FYI, I want to F your A. Maybe we won't have acronyms. That's a pretty social thing. Um. Like, in 20 years, we might just abandon acronyms. Do you really think so? I have a feeling that in 20 years, everything will be acronyms. But... <laughs> said but. <laughs> yeah, you did. Awesome. But... You're always gonna have a but. You're always gonna go pee-pee. You know what, Aaron? Unless somebody invents That's a really like a... salient point you just made. <laughs> 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 so why not embrace it, bro? Yeah, you're right. I've been a fool. <laughs> <laughs> I've been a fool to have standards my whole life. Yeah, yeah. Stay tuned for NSP's fourth album, <laughs> Shitting in the Shit House. Pee pee poo poo town. <laughs> pee pee poo poo town. Starring poo poo and the pee pets. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's really good. It's really good. Help, help, help. I'm sorry. Okay. I can't. I uh, can't help you. I, I, you were too far down and I couldn't draw you a platform. It's okay. I have to draw you. <laughs> really? A platform? Oh. <laughs> next time on Game Grumps. Oh shit, really? Yeah, oh god! Dude, this is very, like, troublesome to be- okay, okay, next time on Game Grumps. Oh, we're good. Aaron. Yeah? For our honeymoon, take me to Pee Pee Poo Poo Town. One-way ticket, please. I never want to leave. Don't you know how expensive it is to get a hotel in Pee Pee Poo Poo Town? I thought you loved me! I don't love you as much as it takes for us to buy a house! Uh... I could get a whole new Mercedes with the amount of money it would take to go to Pee Pee Poo Poo Town! This poop joke took a very, very serious turn. <laughs> I'm leaving you! <laughs> And buying that Mercedes! Okay. <laughs> okay. The Game Grumps! Hello! <laughs> Welcome to X-Men Mutant Apocalypse! Listen, Aaron, I was listening to what you said and I agree with the sentiment. All I want in life is to be loved, and if I'm not, there's going to be out to pay! <laughs> <laughs> You're all going to be dead! <laughs> Everybody on the ground! <laughs> I want the tender embrace of a woman! <laughs> I'll shoot more bullets into the air until it happens! <laughs> Nothing more! <laughs> I'd never hurt anyone! <laughs> Alright, never mind. Uh, welcome to X-Men Mutant Apocalypse. Yes, thank you to David Wyshynski, Amanda Tripp, and Lee Clifford. Um, we have it written down in our records that you sent us X-Men games. We don't know if it was this one, but we should take the opportunity to thank you all anyway. Yeah, I'm surprised you could read the names through my handwriting. It is just because I dictated them to you a second ago. <laughs> I see. I can make out the D and the Y in David Wyshynski and nothing else. <laughs> I also love the name Amanda Tripp because it's like, oh, that guy must be clumsy. <laughs> so stupid. Amanda Tripp. Oh, I got and, it. Anyway, <laughs> I'm sure she got that in high school like crazy. Oh, so I'm I sorry, Amanda Tripp. 
you. But you're a beautiful person. <laughs> Meanwhile, she's like face down <laughs> because she's just fallen over something. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> just claiming my birthright. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Yeah, oh, yeah. Well, I mean, you gotta play a Psylocke first. All right, you go. You go. It's all you, buddy. Psylocke is a cutie. She is beautiful. All right, Psylocke, show your stuff. Show us what you got. Okay, that yeah, is that's, a... That is a... Hovering motorcycle turret. Seems pointless, really. <laughs> My air cycle... Oh, wow, what? her head looks really tiny. <laughs> Onward. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> oh boy. I don't even know if that's gonna come across on the capture, it was so fast. <laughs> the power of Psylocke! <laughs> Man, she got big feet. Look at those feet. Yeah, she's got some size 25s. God damn. <laughs> In women's size. Oh, that's bigger than men's size. It's not. Well, no, I mean. Oh, you're right. It's not. <laughs> I mean, in men's size. Oh, we, the joke's already gone. <laughs> the moment's passed. <laughs> <laughs> but you know what hasn't passed? Dude, ha this like, gas. Look at this fucking gas. <laughs> These guys have like 14 packs. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> How many more abs could you possibly have and <laughs> still be a little bitch that gets your ass kicked immediately? <laughs> Every pixel is a new ab. <laughs> Every pixel is a new opportunity for abdominal yeah. strength. <laughs> I just imagine like the artist brings like the final drawings into the boardroom and he's like, what do you think? And the guy's like, more abs, and he like punches the table, and, like, and the arch. We can't like, fit that many abs and that many pixels. My God, we're out of abs space. <laughs> more abs. Break the packs into six more abs. Invent a new Super Nintendo <laughs> that can handle more abs. Um, I liked girls from like a super young age, but it was like a crazy innocent kind of liking, you know? Oh yeah. Like I, I didn't have like. Like, like like the other oh gee whiz I feel good inside and warm. Well, well the other like guys in my grade and stuff were like looking at Playboy and stuff and I was like, what? Like it, it, I couldn't my brain couldn't even process it. It was too crazy. It was too much. Yeah, I was still fucking going bananas over the fact that Jody went to the fucking roller skating rink with me. Oh yeah, I remember and, you telling me that yeah, story. Yeah, and watched oh. as I played Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Turtles in Time. Oh, she was just being polite. <laughs> she didn't know how to date either. <laughs> Jeez oh, whiz! That's the full-on Street Fighter death. Yeah, well, this is made by Capcom. Ooh. Really? Really? Oh, really? damn. That's how it goes? Oh, and you only have one Psylocke left. Oof. All right, I'll go with Wolverine. Goo. All right. Logan. Bub. Hey, what's up, bub? Excuse me. He doesn't need to fly in on a spaceship. He just fucking jumps out of a window, and he's like, Hey, what's up, bub? Hey, I'm fucking blow this shit up! <laughs> Whatever, fuck you! <laughs> <laughs> you guys know where the bathroom is, I gotta drop a load again. So, oh man, I'm super hunched over. God damn, my back, my lumbar support isn't working out. <laughs> oh, yeah, fuck you! you fucking blow this shit up! What are you guys doing here, bub? <laughs> Multiple bubs. Fucking bub, 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 bub. The only time you hear, like, bubs more is, like, when you're in, like, a Jewish retirement home. Like, hello, bub. <laughs> oh, Bobby. God damn, these guys, yeah. I, Psylocke can kick. Yeah. Wolverine has, um, knives on his hands, and it still takes the same amount of hits. That is weird. Like, come on, man. It's fucking Wolverine. She did have powerful Whoa. thighs, though. Oh, damn. Awesome. Yeah, you fucking like this, bub? <laughs> <laughs> wow, it, right into steel. I can do that shit. I'm fucking adamantium, bub. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, see that fucking bub? Fuck you, bub. <laughs> <laughs> fucking laser wall shit. <laughs> 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 Fuck you, bub! <laughs> Fuck you! Hey. Hey. Uh. Ow! <laughs> <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ! Where the fuck am oh, I? Green yeah. factory? Fuck you, There's bub! There's a fast going green! <laughs> you counted to one! <laughs> Man, I thought I was made out of Aunt Manty and throwing grenades around. Fuck you, bub! <laughs> 
<laughs> Bubba, I don't even know what the fuck Bubba's going on, Bubba. I don't think you're gonna make it, dude. You're in trouble. Fuck <laughs> Bubba. <laughs> dude, like, he has, like he's sleeping and he's having a restless like sleep. He's like... <laughs> <laughs> Hey, watch out, babe. Hey, hey, babe. <laughs> that, oh. Oh, he's, he's way better at fighting dude. these dudes with the Psylocke. Holy crap. Awesome. He's got like crazy air combos and shit. Look at this. Nice. I can, like, dash at him with my bub. <laughs> my, my bub dash. <laughs> my bub dash. <laughs> this is my world famous bub dash. Watch this. <laughs> bub dash! <laughs> got him right in the bub. <laughs> Patented myself. This is my bub clown. Bib, 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 Fucking muttering it to himself constantly. Yeah, what am I in a fucking spinal column? What is this? Rub a dub dub. Thanks for the bub. Oh, man, snub the bub. Yeah, one and two and three. Bub ass fucking bub. Oh, boy. What the what the hell was the point of this guy over here? Oh, he snubbed your bub. I just snubbed my bub. Gotta beat up this bub. Bub. <laughs> Bubbed him good! <laughs> Man, that looks looking pretty good. Give me a little bit of a bub chub. <laughs> oh! What's going on, bub? Oh. <laughs> what is this bub action, That's bub ass looking bub? Uh, damn. Damn, dude. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> <laughs> and they had to have a guy come at me. There's such an insane ass whooping. His fucking picture in the in the menu screen is just like I had to buy a mouth guard. <laughs> CVS, man, <laughs> helps me from snoring. <laughs> Grind my teeth, <laughs> man. <laughs> Otherwise, I wouldn't be able to enjoy sugary beverages on the rigs. Grinding my frags. <laughs> my, I meant to say fangs, but I said frags. <laughs> <laughs> oh man! Oh, these frags of mine. That speech class I took in middle school isn't working out, bub. <laughs> round and round the rugged rock, the ragged rascal ran, bub. <laughs> I still know that one pretty well. <laughs> I practice every day. Bub. Sam the slippery seal. <laughs> Hub the bubby from that bub. Ah, damn it! I did it again. Put my own little personal spin on that one. I don't know if you can tell. <laughs> Bubbity, bubbity, bubbity. <laughs> uh, my teacher told me it wasn't smart to do it, but I would have been My sweet bubs. <laughs> my sweet bubs. <laughs> yay! <laughs> ah, Jesus. God damn it. Yeah, he, when he jumps, he's very, like, happy. He's like, yay! <laughs> Bub! <laughs> <laughs> so good to see you! <laughs> oh, man. All right, you gotta try to beat this guy without oh, he's taking damage. Easy as fuck, dude. Okay. Okay, oh. what is he doing? Oh, he didn't do that last time. Oh, man. Yeah. That's a big old tub for the bub. <laughs> That's bub tub. Right now. <laughs> <laughs> and you know how I love to be some bub tub. Oh, yeah. I scrubbed that bub tub just the other day. Scrub tub bub love. <laughs> <laughs> Scrub the nubs off that bub tub. <laughs> oh, yeah. Nice. Nicely Snub. done. Snub that bub. <laughs> My bub. <laughs> so you got that going for you. My bub. Give me a rub, bub. Later, buddy. Can you give me one more, like, I'm dying, bub? <laughs> bub. <laughs> no, no, the full, like, bub. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God, that tickles my fancy. Yeah. There's something about. There's something about Logan saying boob. <laughs> it's just... It's magic. In this code of growth, I'm a girl. In the other code of growth, I'm a girl. In the Oh, baby. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I, I feel it. I feel it. <laughs> I'm feeling the cheap, cheap falls. Okay, so this is hole five. And uh, we have one episode left to uh, do tonight. Yeah. And I don't think we can save this game, can we? No, I don't know. So do, do you just want to go four more holes, and then we'll call it whoever's winning it after nine? Fuck yeah. All right. You Which is gonna be me. It's gonna be me. Did you see that shot? Holy fuck, it got way farther than it thought it would. Oh, I thought you meant that shot of Justin Timberlake, where he has, like, the ramen noodle hair. <laughs> oh, it was noodly. It was super noodly. Yeah. Why was that a good thing? Why was that a good thing? I don't know. I remember, like, the late 90s and thinking, like, God, like, 
These frosted tips look stupid, but everyone has them, so like, you gotta do it. I... It was a different time. I, I, uh... I, I feel like there was one point where I was like, I'd say this is like, objectively cool. Oh, sure. Like, I think this will last. It never does. It really never oh, does. Yeah. yeah, no. It, it, it always ages badly. And the weird part is, we don't even know what we're doing now that's going to look stupid <laughs> later, yeah. you know? It, it could be anything. Low rider pants? Could be, but yeah, I don't know. It's it's harder now because like I feel like there's not as much like one style that encompasses everything. Yeah. You know? It feels a little bit like maybe, everything's fractured. Maybe like the hipster thing? Like the lumberjack style? Oh, definitely style. that. Yeah. 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 It yeah. might my, seem weird in the future. My, um... My friend Kelly refers to, uh, those, like, uh, Oregon hipsters that... She, well, she, she lives in Portland, and, she, like, there's a lot of dudes there in flannel with, like, big beards, uh, and, like, bald heads, and she refers to them as metronomes. <laughs> <laughs> Did you get it? <laughs> I do. <laughs> metronomes! I think it's pretty brilliant. That's, that's fitting. Yeah. That's fitting. She's, she's, a, she's a smart one. You ever played shuffleboard? I I never played shuffleboard, but um, it's kind of it's weirdly fun. There were old folks. God damn it! Um, there were old folks at my um, at my community pool, who I liked to hang out with when I was a little kid. And uh, is that weird? What? That weird. I like to hang out with the old people? Yeah. They were just super nice and like they liked. I don't know the other. The other kids my age were like doing douchey things like fucking stuffing girls' heads under the water and things like that. Oh, like, yeah. I don't want to do that. So I'd hang out with like the grandmas and grandpas and like help them like retrieve bocce balls that got away and stuff. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, and they'd tell me stories about like oh, the yeah. 30s and shit. They probably fucking loved you. They, they, they were sweet. I wonder what happened to them. I mean, they're dead. They're all dead. <laughs> Thank you for bringing it up. I didn't bring yeah, anything I, I, up. I know. It was all me. <laughs> but. But yeah, they they were they were really old. Oh, they they damn they were old because I remember they were telling me stories about like 1915 and stuff like that. Oh my god. Yeah, bet you I can throw this football over those mountains. Try it, try it. That is a Napoleon Dynamite reference, my oh, friend. Oh shit, that's right. You need to watch it again, dude. It's been a while. It's wonderful. Since you've said you're sorry. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a while. <laughs> Since I my head up everywhere. golf ball. I like to imagine he's like, yeah, because you know, they're like those hard rockers that are like super famous. Mm -hmm. You know that famous picture of, um, what's his face? The guy from James Hetfield? Yep. That famous picture of him on Rodeo Drive with like an Armani bag. Oh, the best. <laughs> the best. And someone fucking posted the alternate like lyrics to one. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Like, bargains imprisoning me. <laughs> All that I see. Absolute saving. What a great deal. What a great find. Look at these jeans. Devil looks sexy as hell. <laughs> what a great deal. <laughs> One of the funniest memes I've ever fucking seen in my life. Fuck! <laughs> <laughs> oh man! <laughs> oh my god! That, that shit is the funniest to me. The, the, the absolute. I mean, best. it's because like you can't deny it, dude. It's like. Yeah. Well, I mean, he's a dad now. Yeah. Well, Buy, buying stuff for his daughters. It's just plus. It's like. I don't know. There's no way to make that image feel- Ah, oh, come on! Feel cool when you, like, make a lot of money from being super fucking famous and crazy yeah. music star. Yeah, and I mean, like, he, he gets a lot of unnecessary shit. Yeah, what is he gonna do, live in a trailer? Right, yeah. Like, there, there were those other ones where, like, he, he's going through, like, a metal detector at an airport, and it, like, the top says, like, metal detector, and then, like, the bottom is, like, none detected. <laughs> it's like, so fucking unfair. <laughs> that dude gave us Master of Puppets, god damn Oh it. yeah, dude, man. Metallica fucking rocked. Oh, so good. Alright, well, I lost the shit out of this game. Aaron, well, I hope you're proud of yourself. Yeah, you gave it your all. That's all I, that matters. I, yeah, I did. Yeah, I did. I gave it my all. I gave it my all. Whole 10, we're not playing this. It's a relaxing <laughs> experience.
Oh, come on, there's only 450 Ys of yardage. <laughs> it's not Ys of yardage, my friend. It's 450. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, next time on Game Grumps. Yeah, something completely different. We love you very much. I do feel better. This helped a lot. Oh, good. Yeah, the power, the healing power of, uh, of video game golf. Maybe I'll give you a hug afterwards. I, I would actually really like that. Okay. Okay. Goodbye, everyone. Goodbye. I'm just gonna put this just... Just gonna putt this 250 yards. Oh shit, water hazard? Did you see that? Yeah. Oh, I saw it, bro. One of the best shots. Yeah, yeah. Check this shit out. <laughs> Fuck yeah! Holy nice, nice shot! shot. <laughs> where, where to go? Uh, uh. I'm not getting it. I'm not fucking getting it. Koopa's like, I'm out of here. Nice shot, dude! I'm nailing it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Are you not even gonna take this seriously, Yoshi? This uh, is Mario Golf. You're right, here I go. <laughs> That's the one. Yes! <laughs> Woo! Yay. You grumped the shit out of that sesh, bro. Thank you, bro. Hello there, I am Danny. And I'm Ross. And uh, as of today, uh, June 25th, 2015, we have been on this Game Grumps channel for two years. And uh, we just wanted to say thank you so much for having us, and uh, we're incredibly grateful. Like the personally, the amount of awesome people that mm. I've met uh, as a result of the show just like have made my life, my my lives, yes. <laughs> my life, my life so much better. And um, I uh, and I love you guys, and it just Absolutely. means a lot. I mean, it's opened up a lot of opportunities for us, and it's been a wild ride, and I'm really happy to be a part of it. Remember when we mm -hmm. were filming the first thing for Steam Train and Aaron was chucking stuff from off screen and he yeah. hit you in the head with the giant slinky? Yeah, it's still in there. <laughs> that was awesome. Did I ever tell the story about the the bee? The bee? Yeah. What? No. This is kind of a weird story, but I might as well tell it. Tell it. I mean, so, we're here. When we were when we first started Steam Train, it's no secret that everyone was like, Gah! like so. Basically, what happened was like, you know what? I'm just gonna just gonna go uh escaped to the beach for uh you know oh the beach yeah i escaped to the beach for the day and i was just like you know what i'm gonna pull myself away from the internet and i'm just gonna relax so i went to the beach with holly and i've been working on a pokemon cartoon that i was doing uh it's up now it's a long time up uh but i went down to the beach i'm relaxing trying to just kind of think about stuff and i was like you know what it's not that big a deal it's not that big a deal i'm just stressing about it and all of a sudden on my right hand i feel something fuzzy and then I hear, feel, then I immediately feel something very sharp. No shit, you got stung by a bee? I got stung by a bee. This is the day that Steam Train launched. I got stung by a bee on the beach. Whoa. And my first reaction was like, fuck! Like, really loud, sorry. And I was like yelling on the middle of the beach, and all these like surfer guys are like, bro, are you all right? And I'm like, I got stung by a fucking bee! And, and also then, your feelings got stung by YouTube comments. Yeah. So I, I, I literally, this guy walks up and looks at it, he's like, Hey man, just go to the, 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 the lifeguard. He'll have some stuff for bee. And I'm like, bees? I'm like, what the fuck? What the, why will lifeguard have something for bees? It's like, I'm not a fucking shark. Right. I walk in there and he had, he had something for bees. Cool. So, and then I got that sorted, but in that experience, I was like, you know what? This is just its phase. This is going to pass. <laughs> Nothing, it, YouTube's, you, you now know. Now it's full circle. You know, it's like, you think about it and like things can be, people can be negative, but you know, just give things a chance and then they adjust. You know? Yeah, yeah. And honestly, like, it feels so, it feels like so long ago. We intended this to be like 10 seconds long, by the way. Yes. Sorry we're rambling. Yeah. Sorry, Barry, that you have to stand there. What a guy. Um, but yeah, like, I don't think either of us knew what to expect when we first no. joined the show. Uh, although I did know that because I was replacing someone so beloved, yeah, even anything, yeah. yeah that yeah. like I was gonna be the most hated man on the internet. Yeah, and Aaron was like, "Yeah, that's gonna happen." But like, <laughs> just he was, he was, it was very positive. Yeah, just yeah, be yourself, yeah. and things will work out. Absolutely, and, and they did. And yeah. um, we're just, uh, I don't know. I'm just, I'm glad they did, and I'm, I'm glad yeah. everything happened the way it did. And people started to accept us. So yeah. that was cool. Um, and, and we love you. Yeah, I love you guys. Uh, you know, it's. It's awesome that you know, like, because of this opportunity, we've you've had a chance to do like all your albums, Star Mom, and as well as NSP. Yeah, yeah. And now I'm doing a cartoon show, which is slowly happening. But you know, 
These are things, these are opportunities that wouldn't have presented themselves to us if we had not have joined Game Grumps. Yeah, we're basically saying you guys have made all our fucking dreams come true. Absolutely. So uh, that's, it, it means the world to us, and, and we love you dearly. Mm -hmm. And uh, I hope you enjoy X-Men Apocalypse Un Unlimited something, which is about to start now. Oh, okay. Okay. You're not in it, but I, I know. mean, you're wonderful. People, I, I people was watching from the window. Oh, okay. I wasn't. Bye.